Ready? Yes, ready? Microphone check. One, two. Skip the bullshit. You already know the Gemini Scorpio podcast. Episode 46, I believe. We at Dang. 46. It's 46. Yeah, man. It's 46. I'm just Dang. waiting. I'm just waiting until we get to 146, 156, you know. But we living in the moment. Niggas it's never satisfied. Right. 46. I'm ready to get to 50. You feel me? We yeah. have four episodes from 50. Yeah. yeah. You looking good, Shorty. Thank you, babe. Got the little curls and all popping and shit. Somebody <laughs> had a birthday and shit. You feel what I'm saying? Got the birthday, birthday glow. I know. It's giving birthday glow. It's giving 30 glow. Let's do our small introductions, okay. man. Gemini Scorpio like Podcast. Mr. J. Hill, I'm in the building. Healer Bay is here. Hold I up. am here. Hello? He's run away, oh, even though yeah, Jay interrupted my intro Every with his time. motherfucking phone call. What'd you, what'd you say, bro? <laughs> I'm at the uh, side. Oh, so you, you came late and shit, bro. It's 2 o'clock. You came late. Um, You should be able to open the top. I can't say it on the podcast because you no, actually. No, no, no. Please don't. Please don't. Hey, yeah. You, you, you don't. on the podcast right now. <laughs> oh, shit. You want to tell him who you is? Tell him. It's Von Chase. Shout out to him. He's late. He's Shout fucking up to... the whole podcast right now. <laughs> yo, he ain't, he ain't fucking thought, it up. Yo, I right. did try to pull up right before. All right, we about to, we about Whoa. To, we about to send somebody down for you, all right? Why well, I'm so uh, dramatic. Uh, Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I was so dashing though. I'm sorry, uh, Jay Ms. Always Greenaway. Yes, Miss Greenaway, I'm in the building. You know, Period. I'm feeling a little bit under the weather, but relax. Whoa, it's not whoa, COVID, whoa, whoa, whoa. So, we ain't had yeah. to, that's, that's certain information we yeah, have. Yeah, certain shit you on the podcast. Right, right, right. Because now they going to be looking at us like, these niggas tripping. That's how <laughs> shitty I feel. But I'm like, but you know what I hear? Like, Why everybody who, everybody who got COVID, it's not COVID. It's not COVID. Disclaimer. It's not COVID. So I had COVID. What happened is I ended up getting tested. <laughs> nah, I'm nah, good. I'm good, man. Sinus infection. That's it. Think. Well, damn, we'll what a no spot. Fucking. What do you call a diagnosis, <laughs> bitch? It's like, nah. Like, Myself hip di- <laughs> my <soul> diagnosis. <laughs> <laughs> It's I'm like, like, well, according to what is the thing on Google where every WebMD, according to WebMD, I have a sinus infection. Ever go to WebMD? No, if it doesn't do that, clear up do in two weeks, they said that I'll be dead. But you know, <laughs> literally, no, that's me though. Jay hates it. Like I'll go and I'm like, you know what? These are my symptoms. I feel like I'm dying. But well, M- <laughs> WebMD said I have. I be some shit that you nah, can't even pronounce. Be no, because let me be tell y'all something. When COVID, when COVID first started, right? Y'all, y'all, this is a funny story, real quick. So I had like these dark circles around my ankles, right? <laughs> Mind you, I had been working out outside. So I've been, I was wearing like yoga pants, whatever. So I had some dark circles around my ankles. So I got very scared because I'm thinking that my circulation is cutting <laughs> off. So I went to WebMD <laughs> and they said that my, I could, I had high <laughs> blood pressure and that if I didn't see a doctor immediately, like I could be dying. So, you know, I did a virtual, I tried to sign up for a virtual <laughs> meeting with my doctor and she was like, uh, dark circles around the ankles, like come in right away. So when I was on the way, my dad kept saying, man, that's a 10. <laughs> that's a 10. <laughs> you, are you mean. stupid? That's a 10. <laughs> So it's so, COVID. It's a, it's a wing worm. It's a fucking dirt Look, ring. Look, I'm, yeah, I'm not. I was scrubbing that bitch in the shower to make sure. I'm like, I have no fucking gazy jewelry on my ankles. What's going on? So I get to the doctor or whatever. It's real shut down because it's COVID. I get into the back. So the lady's like, lay down. So she's like, when you lay down, do you feel any pressure here, here? I'm like, maybe a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> so then she's like, she takes the light out. And she goes, this is a 10. <laughs> so I'm like, oh my God, I'm so embarrassed. So then... <laughs> When I get in the car, I call my dad because he's like, let me know what they say. Let me know what they say. So he's like, what they say, what they say. I'm Yo, like, well, like, well, I'm dying. Yeah, I, said, I was like, well, you know, they said that there's something that's causing irritation to the ankles of my skin. Because you couldn't tell and me what the sun was. I couldn't tell him. I couldn't tell him. The only thing that's irritating your skin is the sun. Hey, Von Chase. It was a good you. Welcome. I talk about us, man. We just. Fucked up his in- well, you Alex did introduction. it first, so it's, I had to do it one time. For it's the boys. okay, Alexander the blonde. I'm talking black and black. Jasmine fucked it up. Oh. I fucked it up. Oh, you start talking about your tan and Shahini gets. Oh my bad, my bad. That was a funny story though. They gonna hear me. Don't worry. I'm they gonna hear you. There you go, Alexander the blonde is in the building. Let's get into the shit. Hey, shout out to the whole gang is in the building. Hold up, our pink celebrity is here. Joseph D. Friend, Lante, Base God, Gio the Leo, DJ Von Chase is in the building. Um, our only. Crowd guest today is DJ Von Chase, so shout out to him. And hey, he gonna keep quiet. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we I mean, he's a quiet, <laughs> he's a quiet guy for the yeah, most part, anyway. Yeah. So he ain't gonna be yelling unless I might have to sick him. Like, yo, then he gonna he gonna have my back. You know what I'm saying, unless it's like Mimosa City. 
Because then it gets yeah, weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then he's, he's a different character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When Mimosa City is here, yeah, it's, Mimosa a City is different, it's a different vibe. Okay? Because no, no, Mimosa facts. City is different. Okay? Yeah, no, facts, Shout facts. out to Mimosa City in the building. Let's get it popping, man. How was y'all week? Shout out. You want to start? Your birthday. You know, it was my birthday. Y'all, <laughs> I had the wildest turned up trip to Tulum. I just want to say, everybody was trying to tell me everybody's going to Tulum, don't go there. And I ain't going to lie. I, in the beginning, I was persistent. I was like, it. I don't want to go there. Like, I was like, I don't. Everybody's going there. I need to go somewhere different. And then somebody was like, no, you have to go. Yo, Tulum was the most Is it littest. Tulum or is it Tulum? Bitch, I don't or know. It was turnt. <laughs> That's what I know. It was turnt. It's both of them. It was so turnt. Whatever you wanted to be. Tulum. Turn to loom. <laughs> what you talking turn, about? Turn to loom. Turn loom. <laughs> Whatever. But it was just so lit. And shout out to Bay because he planned everything. Everything was like perfect. I mean, honestly, I felt like I was in a matrix in that bitch. It was just so much going on. But you know what I really like about it? It's like a city in a jungle. Like yes. that shit is so fucking lit. Nah, Except the from the pot of cops. Nah. The nah, cops robbed. That was wild. No, the cops definitely the cop. robbed us. No, we gotta tell that story real quick. No, the cops, y'all think the cops corrupt here? But oh, hell no. G Herbo was talking about. Bro, like, no, they were. Like, no, I was uh, okay. So this is the only part of the fucking thing that really just fucked me up. You need to put my mic down a little bit. Uh, please. Ugh. No. Just Jay, <laughs> no, like God damn. You lucky motherfucker, cause you're gonna be she gonna be complaining once she look at the video. That bitch in her face, she like, what the fuck? Ain't nobody tell me. <laughs> Yeah. She's right, like, now, now she's yeah. like, is it there? Is Look, it now? Is it? No, nah, you good. <laughs> so I just got a shout out to Jay because he handled this situation so well because I just knew they were gonna kill us and dump us. But um, long story short, it's we're driving. We meet some girls there, so of course we in the the fucking car piled up like Mexicans. No point intended. So you know. We're in there. It's like we're too. It's too many of us. I ain't gonna lie. We're in there, but we squeezing wow. in. Wow. She just said that they were piled up. Like now nah, fuck the Mexican cops because I'm still mad at Mexico. that. That shit almost ruined my birthday. Fuck this, that Mexican cops. Everybody else ridiculous. People. Everybody's like, oh whoa. Okay, Trump. You're gonna be at my door in like in two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> so boom, we leave in. Uh, you know the city part where all the clubs and stuff is. We come in, whatever, and they already kind of spot checked this going through a light, so they do the flashlight thing. So we get, it's like they scouted us. We get to the other side. We get pulled over. So Jay's like, the cop was like, is that a Dior bag? In there? <laughs> get him. <laughs> they definitely spot changed? us because they, they, they flashed like, the light and they was like, go ahead. And as soon as and we get up, it's the like they pull cop. us over. I'm like, God damn, y'all just told us to go ahead. <laughs> so long story short, they pull us over. Jay winds up the window like, hey officer. They like, <laughs> hey officer. Hola They're officer. Like, they talk, they're just talking shit. Jay's like, English, English. <laughs> so wait, hold on. Time out before yeah, I go before, any further. So before we get pulled over, we're we joking wilding. in the car, like making up all type. But if we get pulled over, I beg it, I beg it. Like niggas need to make enough shit. Like, like no, I'm not begging, like, I beg it, I beg it, I beg it, please. We're doing this. No, no, no. So like we in a car wilding, like we in a car for like 15 minutes before we get pulled over. Me didn't do nothing. And they're like, please, please, they don't lock me up. All of a sudden, woo! I think it's the I whole bag of money. Y'all had to shut the fuck up. Had, we I went know. from our bag eight to nothing is. Like, and y'all niggas probably shook. No, we were shook because I was like, God, I know y'all said we played too much, but this is not <laughs> the fucking time. Now, that's the, that, that shit was so funny until it was that moment. So we get pulled over and we wind up, but we don't speak nothing. All of a sudden, they tell Jay, get out. Yo, my whole soul left my body. I was like, get out. Like, these niggas got AK-40. I'm shook because I'm like, we already deal with this shit in America. So right. I'm like, now we're in another country. There's no rights here. You know what I'm saying? So I'm yeah. like, oh my God. So I hear Jay talking with them like, nigga, I'm in the front praying. All the girls, all the girls in the back, take out their phone. They start recording. We were, they recorded everything. The nigga come. Is there a problem? Is there a problem? Delete it. Delete it. <laughs> nigga. I'm like, oh my god! So I'm like, like, what oh, is about that? He was yeah, oh, no, oh, they didn't fuck around with us. They didn't give a so fuck. I, I, I was like, what's going on? What's wrong? He's like, uh, phones, phones. I'm like, he's like, videos. I'm like, oh, alright. So I just, I'm like, alright, bet. Just delete them or whatever. So like, we we talking. And mind you, I don't really understand. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a um, it's a language barrier. Language 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 yeah. Right? yeah. So they just saying something. So next thing you know, he like, um, you gotta basically you gotta pay us before. Matter of fact, before that, right? This how I ain't gonna lie. I, like I'm glad I didn't get upset before he told me pull out, get out. He was like, he was drinking. He was like, blow. I said, he was like, one, two, three. I'm like, I ain't drinking nothing, nigga. Jay like, didn't even drink. Like, like, I ain't drink. Drink. He didn't like, drink. What are you talking about? So he like, um, 
So he asked me to get out. So I get out. And he talked about the streets, like, tell him to delete the videos and shit. So I'm like, all right, man, y'all just delete the videos. I'm thinking they wasn't going to delete, but I'm like, just fuck it, just delete, delete, delete the videos. So I'm asking what's going on. He's like, man, you got to pay a, uh, I forgot what it's called. It's not called a ticket. It's, it's a called a, um, fraction, a, a, a fraction, infraction. infraction. You, know, you got to pay an infraction. You got to go to the uh, police station tomorrow and pay an infraction, but it's cheaper if you pay us. So I'm like, <laughs> so I'm like, oh, they put I, I that part. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm, he's like, cheaper if you pay us, something like that. Like, so I'm like, all right, how much is it? He like four hundred. I'm like pesos. I'm like, <laughs> what are you talking he about? like, I swear to God. no. You like, like, Jay like, no. Jay like, how, how much is it? He like, well, how much you got? <laughs> no, 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 no. That's exactly what happened. He was like, he was like, he was like, um, he was like, uh, how much you got? I'm like, how much it cost? He like, he like, he like, he like uh, defense four hundred. So it was one of the guys that like one of the guys was an aggressor that was telling him to delete the video, mm -hmm. but the other guy was just like, you know, how you can scary for behind us. that twinkle in your yeah. eye, you a bitch, nigga. So it's like, yeah. you know, so, like, so you talked to him. No, like, no, I, I, I was talking to both of them, but I felt it. So he's he the one that said four hundred. So when he said four hundred. I ain't gonna lie, like, even though they had the guns out, it was like a, a little, See, little real nigga in me. Tell you something no, about the real Jay. nigga in me was like, 400? So he comes in the woods. He wanted to shoot me. No, but you know, he ain't said with confidence, though. Here you go. He ain't said with confidence. So, so when nigga, he said that, I was like, So this nigga Jay was like, just like, was like, <laughs> this nigga Jay comes to the car to get his wallet. The nigga's the acting like, Go ahead. He's acting like he's looking for his wallet. He's taking the money I'm out the wallet. Take it. Take it. Only give me twenty dollars. Oh so the other girl in the back, like, put it in your crotch. I stick this shit up. Like, even, I'm like, even before that, right? This is how I knew. This is how I knew. Cause like, first when he said four hundred, he ain't said with like the confidence, right? Because because yeah. I know at this point I know he's trying to finesse. Cause he ain't. Yeah. It wasn't like it cost four hundred dollars. Mm -hmm. He was yeah. like, they first I was like, how much you got? Then he was like four hundred. I'm like pesos. He then he was like, I mean, how much you got? So I'm like, all right, hold up. So <laughs> mind you, my wallet was on the ground. So I'm looking in a car, acting like I'm looking in a car, but I'm talking to them like, man, they, they trying to get some money or whatever. The police officer said, your wallet right there. So I'm like, fuck. So I nah, pick my sweet. wallet up. Right, I pick my wallet up. I'm thinking, there's no way they're going to let me put reach back in the car. To, nah, hell you know what I'm saying? Because the wallet right there. Yeah. But, I try, but I tried it. I'm he like, tried I bet. He was so like, I'm talking. I'm like, yo, I, I, I kind of put the wallet on the, on, the, um, on the chair. Like, yo, take all the money out. You know what I'm saying? Just give me $20. So they gave me $20. I came back out. I'm like, yo, I ain't going to lie. I got a screen. <laughs> So the cop was bro. mad. The, the, the aggressor was like, he was like, I saw the guy like, bro, I ain't gonna lie. He's like, I, 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 he I, like, I, 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 I know we ain't do all this for no $20. Swear, right? So look, open my wallet. You know how you, I open my wallet, ain't nothing in my wallet. I'm like, bro, I got a car full of girls. I just bought all that food, bro. I'm, I'm not lying to you. Like, the whole time I'm lying. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, I'm being dead. <laughs> and like, so I'm like, all right, I give him twenty dollars. I did like this. I like this. He's like, I'm like, bro, you gonna leave me hanging? Like, <laughs> <laughs> you trying to rob me? Like, yeah, you mad like, at me? Cause you can't rob, rob me, us, bro. That shit was wild. Lie, like, that shit gonna... was wild, bro. Like the they, they was literally just robbing 20, people. I get that nigga twenty. I was like, man, I'm a hustler, man. <laughs> Fuck that. You I'm I can't believe he get that nigga ten dollars. Honestly, I don't think I would have thought of that. So one day was like, take over the mom. I was like, oh shit. What'd you say? Like, the art of gift. What is it? The the gift of gab. The gift of gab. I had a thought. I think I had no at that moment. It was fast too. That's how I was like. At that moment, I had like a thousand dollars in my wallet. I'm like, man, these niggas see the. They gonna take everything. I'm like, man. Fuck that. I'm like, yo, take all this money. Ruin the you know whole trip. We was about to ruin the whole trip. At the end of the ruin day. Ruin the whole but, trip. But at the end of the day, it's like, yo, if I got to pay an infraction, I'm going to pay tomorrow. Because that's what they kept saying. They, that's why they fucked right. up. At. they like, you got to pay an infraction. You can go tomorrow, but it's cheaper today. So I'm like, all right, cool. Bet. I go tomorrow. I fuck around, don't go. Man, that's the fuck. Like, Y'all going to find I'm me at the airport. Like, <laughs> I'm out. You know what I'm saying? But so I'm like, I'll pay tomorrow. They like, uh, cheaper if you pay with us. I'm like, cool. How much? Nigga, like 400. I said, pesos. I swear to God, I'm like, pesos. He's like, <laughs> he said, how much you got? I'm like, Fuck out of here, like, get us $20, nigga, like, See, fuck Outside oh, nah. of the fucking Mexican police and the mosquitoes. The and the mosquitoes, fucking mosquitoes. I can only imagine. Yo, yo mosquitoes is terrible. Yo. Y'all had a net? A yo, net? The Lord. <laughs> a net. Fuck, nigga, no, they, everything fuck was, like, yo, up. bro, I got war wounds. The mosquitoes do not fuck around. So outside of that, amazing trip, amazing birthday. Yeah, oh, was, and then we did family pictures yesterday, so that was cool. Yeah, niggas had the all oh, black and white and shit, like the mob. Like, yeah. Motherfuckers. Yeah. We like the, the Brady Bunch out there. There was only three of us. Uh, but yeah, but yeah, that was that was the weekend for us. What about y'all? <laughs> y'all enjoy y'all y'all enjoy y'all break. A it was break? cool. Oh, <laughs> talking about from. Oh, okay. I'm like a break. My life don't ever fucking stop. <laughs> um, you know. <laughs> You was babysitting and shit. Yeah, bro. I'm Maybe glad you guys enough. enjoyed no. Mexico. So you ain't enjoyed you the, got the rain on the parade. Why you in Vegas or something? Mm -hmm. It was turned up. No, I did go to Vegas. Vegas was lit. 
Um, any 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 good stories for us? Like you meet any celebrities and shit? How many celebrities? Not did you? Ain't no celebrities. How many celebrities DMs? did you meet? So you mean to tell me ain't no celebrities? It was I wrote for me. <laughs> Not one. How many celebrities did so you no, meet? No celebrities <laughs> letting your DM when you was in Vegas. Like, I see she in Vegas. Hey, Miss Greenaway. You asking up? the wrong question. How, how many, many celebrities letting your DM while you was in Vegas? I want to know how many. What's I want to know. I want to know the name. I hate y'all so bad. Y'all not gonna attack my friend. What's that? Hey, you gonna lie to me in front of my face? I'm She's like, t- I'm all five I'm, I'm now. One, two, three, let's, let's go. go. <laughs> oh, black young sister letting you see him? All right. Yeah, I, 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 have, I have no recollection. <laughs> no, let's go. Oh, hang on. I ain't gonna lie. Black young sister letting you see him? That's lit, though. Even though he's a little crazy, but. How could I date black young sister? You don't have to date these niggas. Or how could I even. Problem. How could I even. You it's a because he got money. You just tell him, look. One, you know what I'm saying? Like, two, three. You gotta be like one She's of them. like, Jay, just. No? <laughs> Oh, that's because what? Yeah, that's, 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 that's. how was your week, Jasmine? So, Don't let okay. them torment you. Yeah, you want to tell us the black youngster? So, story? huh? I don't know black youngster. <clears throat> so, wow. but what I do know, what I do know, <laughs> right? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, so yeah, Vegas Young was lit. Dog. <laughs> Jay, are you God drunk? <laughs> Cut one, this fucking two, podcast. Three? I don't know no how fucking many? Young Dolph either. Okay. <laughs> um, black boy Jay Z. I'm just saying this. God, I've been praying to you and I've been doing better. Just keep me on the path. So <laughs> what I was going to say was. No, no young black boy. No. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Okay, listen. All right. All right, all right. We're done. All right. All right. So ahead, yeah, as I was saying, done, Vegas was lit. It was a movie. Um, it's actually kind of like shut down because COVID. So, you know, me and my niggas, we got like turned it up, but it was kind of private. It was. Private. Yeah, <laughs> I said it was private, meaning like we did a private room type thing. And no, it was no freaky shit going on. All right, it was just vibes. It was just vibes because he's Jay. Because Jay, it's it Jay. Was, listen, Monique bought me some body butter. He was like, so "That's some pussy shit." Like, <laughs> it's fucking <laughs> Shea butter, my guy. Right? It's just like so it's for Jay. Ash, Don't you have you know? like Jay? It's Jay. It's Y'all Jay. Talking about the pussy juice and shit. All right, you know what? Yeah. This podcast is going left early. <laughs> so yeah, it was great. Um, had a great time, but. So I went on a date, guys, when Ooh. I got back. Ooh. So I was going to bring him today, but he Ooh. had. Ooh. Hold on, wait, can we not? Can wait, we not hype Cut the cameras. <laughs> Cut the camera. Now keep the motherfuckers rolling. Wait, wait, so, wait, wait. I'm out. Let her tell us about our date. Yeah, okay, so I went on a date. Um, We actually went on like three since y'all been gone. Ooh. So like throughout the week, they was going to work for a week. <laughs> yeah, I know we went like every other day, and then I was gonna invite him today, but he's actually out of town today. So, but um, yeah, I went on a date, and I don't want to call him a regular guy because you know, but I went on a date with a regular guy who doesn't live far from me. Oh. Um, and how do you feel, Saint? And I I do like him, but it's safe to say that you don't like. <laughs> you, get a, you get a different story with a different nigga every other week, no? Damn, like I mean, I'm dating. What you mean? What you mean? Business, what you mean? Uh, yeah, she didn't like a nigga business. one week. The next week, man, this nigga get on my motherfucking nerves. <laughs> you know the vibes, yeah, right? I don't like but, that. Yeah, I don't the moment like you it. say that nigga JD number, your business. don't, don't do say that. that nigga number. The moment you say that nigga number, they start acting different. Oh my god, what the That's fuck it. is that? That's it. That's it right there. I didn't save this guy's number yet, but I like him. Nah, so that's why it's not. That's what. That's why I didn't you change it. <laughs> you right, right. fucking regular, regular. All right, so, regular, so regular. this is what I'm gonna say. This is my. No. This was like an experiment for me, um, because I feel like I haven't been on a regular date with someone like who is in the area in a long time. Right. Uh, he's cool. I had a good time. However, <clears throat> you know, certain things are just for certain people, and I guess just like with the way my life is, like it's just not conducive. <laughs> it's not oh conducive. So Jay it. was right. You don't like him, right? Because he a regular. So you don't like. What's wrong with y'all? Uh-huh. And regular niggas. What's wrong with being a regular, <laughs> wrong with being a regular nigga? I hope he doesn't see this. Not he's gonna see it. He, 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 you know why he's gonna see this? Because he, he, he y'all dating. And when you dating, that first know, couple weeks, know know yeah, for the about first the couple weeks, nah, it's not even you want to know everything. It's like you support him. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, he's gonna, it's, it's gonna be worse because he's gonna watch it with a good heart, with a pure heart. First. He's gonna watch <laughs> it, support you, Jay. He's gonna be like, like I want to support her because I really. Fuck I know with he her. said he's my biggest fan. Damn. 
So he's probably he probably watched all these motherfuckers I'm leading a, up to this. I want to leave because I've had a fucking enough. <laughs> Listen, guys, I want a regular life. I swear to God, I do. <laughs> but I can't have one, and now I've accepted that. It's okay. I just can't. It's okay. I can't. I'm it's flabbergasted. Okay. It's not gonna work. Yeah. I'm why, sorry why, why if you're out there. Why can't it work? It's, it's not gonna work. Why can't it work? How are you gonna break up with on a podcast? Nigga with the three day program with a nigga on a podcast. You know what's you know bad about? The nigga not even gonna get it on the phone. You know what's bad about? You know what's bad about? Break up with a nigga on the podcast. I didn't mean to, but if you're out there, how you break up with a nigga on a podcast? It's not gonna work. This one, this one, this one. Is it this one? You're out there. She don't even know what camera she at. If you're hey. out there, hey. it's not gonna work. You, you know what's you're bad. You're a great guy. You're gonna be great for somebody. You know what's bad it's though. Just not as me. a regular, <laughs> as a regular nigga, right? He's, uh, Three days uh, and one week. Probably spent a lot of money. You want? Because you know, for us, we work for our money. This nigga probably worked hard. Probably blew a bag for him. Yeah, yeah for, him, for him. For him. You hey, said hey, for on one. He probably, he probably, feel, he probably blew a bag. Me? You feel me? Probably a thousand. Like even a thousand, I ain't gonna say more. Let's say a thousand dollars, three dates in, 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 a, in a week. He did not spend a thousand dollars on three dates. I'm just gonna start there. That I mean, because what, hey, wait, what dates cost a thousand? No, I said three <laughs> right. dates. No, three dates. No, three. What you can hit, you can hit a thousand like, in three days. Y'all, what, what did you get? My nigga, you can hit a thousand in three days because you're hitting like three hundred. All right, you know, even if even, I really like even you? a male two hundred. Say a male is two hundred. Okay. Can Two, you say four, what one six. of the dates like just like Nah, that's a thousand. Give, I get it. I get one it. of the um, dates like where you going? Gas. You probably well, buy roses. Days, but, facts, facts. You probably then bought the some outing, clothes then the for the outing. shit. Yeah, the, nah, that's, that's right. That's real. That's right. Real, that's so, real. so think about this. People so don't think about that. So think about this. So, so, right. I'm buying this outfit for you, motherfucker. This is for you. I would have came in sweatpants if it was somebody else. You guys want to laugh? You guys want to laugh? Wait, I wore this outfit on the first day. That's how you know. I was just like, whatever. I'm coming. You know, it never. You bought the shingles <laughs> and then the shingles. Wait, wait. That's hey, some boy. Boy. Hey, yo. <laughs> Jay, go that to hell. Probably, we, probably, we probably bought up on his best shit. Like, I yeah, know, I came out nigga. with this. I got the Christian Dior, Dior. You know what I'm saying? The, 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 nah, the, the fact that she wore this <laughs> to the out, the first date, that she broke up with him in the same. <laughs> Wait, 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 I fuck with him. I want to be friends with him. Um, we could keep Shh. kicking it and see where it goes. But I told him from All the right. gate, look, I ain't got time to be seeing you Alex is every week. I don't have time to bond with you on the phone. None of that. She like I had on nigga. Not Wait. only did she break up with the, this, she Tell friends up with the nigga. Not even on the same friend. Friend. Hold on, hold on. But I okay. Hold up, yeah, hold, up, hold, up, hold, up, hold up. That's what I don't get. So you said Jay's in his feelings. But you're in my bag right now. You think about this. Break it down. No, think about this. I had to get off my chest. Now think about this. Think about this. How are you sick anymore? She said I had to get this off my chest. The first thing she said was not sick anymore. What she went into the story was I was gonna bring him today. So you gonna have this man in here and say that? You That's know, some fucked up shit. You know, I was gonna bring this. This is where we live at. <laughs> you can't do that here. He would have been breaking shit. Go on the first time. This, fuck? this is why. You see, the first time. Wait, this is why you should have lied. This is why because I wanted you guys to give me, like, kind of like. Kind of so you wouldn't have broke up with him right now? We're not together. There's no breaking up to do. But what I have. No, I would have still did this. Oh, yeah. wow. But hold you on. You did it no, with him right now. No, do hold on. Like so that? listen, this is the thing. Like, I wanna bring him around. I wanna try this normal shit. Um, the problem is this. Like, okay, so. I think that, like I said, I think he's a great guy. I want to keep trying this, but like, have has anyone ever felt like just like you're doing something and you know it's not you? And okay. there's nothing wrong with the person. Yeah. Like he's very attractive. Yeah. He has a good job. He's mm -hmm. a good dad. He's mm. he was it was a great date. He was a gentleman. Yeah. Um, but like, I want to burn the world down, so and I'm like, so he's not gonna it, do it so with me. Oh, so he's oh, like Joker. he's like me. She's like Joker. No, he's not like you because you said, his personality. Because she
Yeah, I need a nigga yeah, that's see, gonna yeah, see, ride. See, yeah, nah, but nah. see, you know, it's this is what <laughs> that's it is. what Charlotte be with. I'd be like, come on, what? Let's think. Everything, about this. I think everything. I had your bag when the Mexicans no. cops came. So stop. But I think you everything be could be queen right. Slim. You know what? I can't oh. even. Finish oh God, my, my date analysis. Cause <laughs> this bitch talking about Queen and Slim, but I feel you though. <laughs> all I'm gonna you know say is, all I'm gonna say is, real question though. Why? Okay. Why don't you think you could date real niggas? I mean, huh? I'm sorry. Why don't you think you could date regular niggas? I'm like, hold on. I date some real niggas, bro. Yeah, this this episode, this episode is a dub. Throw it in the trash. All right, so this is what I'm gonna say. A dub. That's the name of the podcast. Like, I don't think that we can. Um, connect like right now. Not him, but why can't you date a regular dude? A regular dude. So you know, I think that the way my life is set up, I just don't think that it's possible. Like I think that it's very hard to understand <clears throat> what I do for a living. I think it's very hard to adjust to um certain. I guess like I don't have time. I don't have time. That's it right there. I don't have time. So like. I don't have time to kick it with you every week. I don't have time to stay out with you all night. I don't have, you're like, but you stay out with me all night. That's different. I don't have time. I have time for I that. I don't have time. I don't right? Have time for that. <laughs> I don't have time for that because I have time for that. <laughs> you be there you too, nigga. Be, you be right here. Because like, I quit, look, like Drake here. said, man, all the love I need is at the rodeo. Period. All right? Okay, all the love I need rodeo. is at OVO. This okay. is the gang. No, but all jokes aside, I don't know what it is. Something's wrong with me, y'all. And I, come to that realization like there's something wrong with me like I have some serious commitment issues like I'm looking for all these things of why can't I settle down or why can't I take someone seriously why can't I do this I have commitment issues but like not really? not for, not fake ones like real ones but is it really that why can't I settle down or is it again why can't I settle down with a regular guy because you know what I think I think she could if the connection could be what if she want to watch yeah there's no she, connection yeah, she doesn't have the connection I feel like it's because of your experiences it might be because and, you've gone through different Alex. experiences. No, 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 no. Real shit, though. Don't see it. Don't see it. Close your no, eyes. Because you've gone like, through turning the fucking therapy of all my commitment. Nah, issues. real quick, though. Because you've had different experiences, it might be like you've liked something about each individual. So you're trying to find a person that can match like all of those different experiences. But you might not, what you're not going to. <laughs> you so it's just like. I didn't fucking say it. He did. Just, it's, like, it's almost like you're looking for a false reality. Like you want. All these people went to one when that ain't gonna happen. Right. You know so saying? you just have to find someone. And it's okay that, to. Yeah. Well, I don't look at it like that. <laughs> Alex, how was your week? <laughs> week is great. It's Refreshing. Not, no, that's, that's, like, <laughs> We're not gonna <laughs> fuck. We're like gonna dissect conversation. my friend on the fucking podcast. <laughs> I think, okay. You know, but let me just say, I want to say one more time to the guy. If you're watching this, <laughs> this is not me saying, oh, I don't ever want to hang out with you again. It's just me being honest. Like, I don't think this is a weird way to be honest. I know, but see, this is what I mean by like. This is my life, you I'm know? Sorry, I'm not laughing at but you. But what, if, what, if, what, what if, if he watched this, right? Are you going to be the before? opposite? What oh. if he watched this and he was like, I could do that. I, 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 I like this. I, that's I, dope. I, I accept that. That's dope. But that's the question I was going to ask you. Then Did you even be like, have the conversation? I, I need to find out another way. See, but that's the thing. <laughs> that, you, you that's made just, that. That's just, that didn't work out. Did you have that conversation <laughs> with him? Well, it was COVID. And come I'm to dying. the determination <laughs> that you couldn't live that lifestyle? Or did you make that decision Okay, I'm sorry. Wait, did I what? I said, did you have a conversation about your life with him already? Mm-hmm. And realize that it's, so, it's different, or did you just come like after going to the date? She's like, "This is not no." It. So I tried to have a conversation with him about it, and it's like the engagement level just was not there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like even things that that we all talk about, like you know, some people they don't they mark. I'm not. I don't want to like talk down on it, but like not everybody has the same end goal. So I think like it's kind of hard to understand like where I'm at with as far as hunger and mm -hmm. just having my eyes set on something mm -hmm. when your your goals are not the same. Mm -hmm. So it's mm -hmm. like, you know, we're all kind of entrepreneurs in our own right. Mm -hmm. So he's not. You know what I'm saying? And it's like But I can relate to you with that. Look, mm -hmm. In a way, like, but she still does things that are outside of her I nine mean, to five. He doesn't. But 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 she just started doing that, honestly. That's okay. not true. So, that's not true. No, yeah, because when I knew you, we was been, been trying to, to was been start trying to get shit. Before you. Yeah, yeah but, I mean, but when I met her, it was really just nine to five type shit. But that was, no, but that was the space she was yeah, in because was we were trying to start yeah, like a clothing years, line, all kinds years, of shit right, way before. Honest, I, didn't, I didn't know that. Right. And it's no, well, I'm, and, and playing devil advocate, we don't know what he tried before you. Yeah. And because me and Shadi didn't have that conversation too often. I think we might have had it a couple times. I ain't going to take it from her. Mm -hmm. But what I will say is we were very different in that way. And even sometimes now. So I don't think it's the end goal. I think what happens is our interests are different. Right. And so we spend time with each other and we, and we see that, you know, we as a people together can coexist 
with having different interests. And there's nothing wrong with that okay. on your end. Or, or well, also, so you think like, I'm, you think maybe I'm quitting too early? Yeah. Um, but I can't. So, so here's what I will say. Here's what I will say. So <laughs> and, I'm like, a week is like no, a year like, in no, my time. Hold on, like hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want to drag whoa, it, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You Scorpios just are your not quitting. Your nerves. <laughs> look, look, look. I, I look Thank you, Joe. Thank you, Joe. Thank you, Joe. I was like, wait a minute. I had to see the one. Thank you, Joe. Like, the fuck out of here. You shouldn't be. Excuse me, y'all. You don't got to be scared to Bernie get your Mag, ass Bernie Mac, shout out to Bernie Mac, R.I.P. So, so ain't fuckers. never got to be that. Hey, hey, okay. But what Ooh, I want to say like is sometimes, even to touch on Engel, like sometimes it's not even the the entrepreneur versus lifestyle. Sometimes people are content. So like even as a nine to fiver, I've yeah. never been content with a certain lifestyle. I always was evolving. Some people are actually content with being where they are. Yeah. So that actually makes it hard to be somebody who wants to keep evolving in a yeah. certain way. Sometimes and I don't, it's not just about the lane and it's I don't want to knock anybody for yeah, that but, yeah, but it's just that's different. okay well, just but, different. Right, but, look, sometimes, but it's just not for me it's not for me I don't have to let it to get to a month to know that you, though you yeah. know what I'm saying to, to add on to what you just said sometimes people are content because they don't know about yeah, exactly. the other side but I don't have to have the, the but here's the thing I don't have to have the patience to show somebody either I don't have to do that you don't have to have the patience but you can't like you said you said no analyzing shit you said that you have a problem right and yeah. I'm just saying, looking at you, right, and looking at the situation, playing devil's advocate with some truth in it, I feel like we look at things differently. So just because you think you were always always progressing and always yeah. doing things to move forward, mm -hmm. I could have looked at you like, she's fucking content. Like, she don't want to do more. You right. know what I'm saying? That, that's my perspective of you. And what I'm saying is I feel like understanding that you have a problem, I don't think it's nothing. One, I don't think there's nothing wrong with either or. I'm just mm -hmm. giving another perspective. That's it. So don't, I'm not trying to change your mind at all. All I'm saying is if you know that you have a problem, there's nothing wrong with just being more patient sometimes. Okay. I'm not saying that you should you should force it, but mm -hmm. I'm saying if you know you have a problem and you know he he piqued some type of interest in you, it, it, it won't hurt you to challenge yourself this time. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's all I'm saying. And again, it won't hurt you to do what you're doing. If you don't want to do that, that's yeah. fine too. I'm not... But either I'm saying yeah. it ain't... It I, think, I think you're and, right though. I think... <clears throat> go ahead, but, Alex. I was going to say, but to add to that, if it's a red flag, if it's something that you see is triggering oh, yeah. in that capacity, yeah. you don't all right, have to do go it. with that. Yeah. But if it's exactly. not no, a red flag, also, but that I that feel is. like the fact that she's even say, "Look, that don't mean we can't hang out," and still because she's still willing to give it a try. Should, yeah. This is just her reality this right now, and it could change. Yeah. Right. And it, it could, could change. change. But right now, that's just where she at. That's okay. That's how I feel. Speaking it of relationships, and but speaking of relationships, I feel like that's a great way. That's that's a great segue to go into um one of our segments. We talk about Nikki Giovanni, and I feel like this is perfect to go into. Let's go. Let's go into it. Just um. It was time so we can hear it. Ooh, I needed that, guys. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome, Snake. Oh, shit. My bad. That's me. My bad, y'all. Give me a second. Do, 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 do. <laughs> so, like, nah, my, my, my screen be, my screen yeah. be wild. Because all I can, back. all I know that works in the world is a relationship. Yes, all right. Okay, that that's all that's going to work. It takes two people to have a relationship. Yeah, but but it, but the relationship. If you don't have a dream, fake it. But the relationship, you can't fake a dream. You got to fake it, because we don't have dreams these days. How the hell can you have a dream? For what? Well, this is so, so everybody's everybody's jiving, but let's jive on that level. If I love you, I can't lie to you. Of course, you can lie to me, and you will if you love me, and you're going off with Maddie someplace. You're lying to me. Because what the hell do I care about the truth? I care if you're there. What Billy Holiday say, hush now, don't explain. All right, I accept that. Of course. All of right, course you lie to me. Because I don't even want to care. What, what does the truth matter? And why are you going to be truthful with me when you lie to everybody else? You lied when you smiled at that cracker down the job, right? Lie to me. Smile. Treat me the same way you would treat him. I can't treat you, you the must. way I treat him. You must. Because I've caught the, I've caught the frowns and the anger. He's happy with you. Of course he doesn't know you're unhappy. You grin at him all day long. You come home and I catch hell because I love you. I get least of you. I get, I get the very minimum. And I'm saying, you know, fake it with me. Is that too much of the black woman to ask of the black man? For 10 years so that we can get a child on his feet that says, yeah, father smiled at mother. He talked to me about school today. Who cares that you can read or can't read? Most Americans can't read. Most people can't read. What y'all think about that? I'm gonna let the ladies go. Um, what did y'all get from that? So my perception of what I got from that video, um, I think um, to me it boils down to the everyday. You know, I do agree where it comes into a stance where sometimes couples are just not as nice to each other as they are with everybody else. And like even that point where she's like, you know, you smiled at the cracker at your job. 
but you come in here, you give me attitude and you give me frowns and I got to know all your frustrations. And now all of a sudden, like, I can't have that smile because you walk through the door in here. You know what I'm saying? I got to get the backlash. And I think that relationships do do that a lot. It's a, it's a level of comfortability that comes into it <clears throat> where all of a sudden now we can't be nice to each other because you had a bad day. But if mm -hmm. your friend calls you on the phone, it's like, no, nah, I'm good. Like, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? I'm good, but I have to deal with that. Now, overall, I don't think she's saying like, lie to me, like lie to me in that aspect. I just think yeah, when it course. comes to the emotion of just the day to day, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you're going to treat everybody nice and then until you get to, to me, I have to hear all the frustrations and all these things. You don't have to treat me bad or you know, these things just because you're upset, like I should get the nice version of it like you would give everybody else. Mm -hmm. That's my perception of what I got. That's a great, that's a great take on it. <clears throat> so I think that, um, you know, I think what she's saying is pretty clear. I think that maybe the wording is misleading, um, but I think she's basically saying like compromise a little bit more with me. Um, if you can compromise for, I guess, your job or whatever else, you should definitely be able to compromise for your woman. However, I agree with what Sade said. You know, when you're closest to somebody, it's almost like you tend to hurt that person the most because you're most vulnerable with them and you really don't want to have to mask it when you get home. But I get what she's saying. Like, you know, it's OK to, you know, fake it till you make it at some at some in some instances. I don't think you lie about <clears throat> how you're feeling or, you know, your mood or whatever. But I think that you can work to mask your mood a little bit more just to save your partner's mood. Because when you come in with all that negativity, it brings your partner down. And if this is somebody that you love, you shouldn't want to hurt them. Even if it's in unintentional, you got to figure out a way to, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Make, make sure that you're protecting them in the same breath. So it's definitely a difficult task, right. but I agree with what she says, you know, like fake it till you make it. Like if make me feel good, even when you're not feeling good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Would you protect you? You protect me from everything else, but yeah, you don't protect me from yourself. Yes. Jeez. And that's probably what's hurting me the yeah. most because I care the most about that. Yeah. What about you, Alex? Do you, do you, mm, it was, so I had a take on it yesterday cause I had written it down when I heard it the first time. And it, what I got from it was like, we, we settle for the lie seeking comfort, but we end up finding more despair on the road. And I said that because it's like, I feel like we should be able to be transparent at times, but I do understand. I mean, I hadn't heard that extended clip. So when she broke it down in the sense of like for 10 years so that our kid could say that he saw my mm -hmm. father smile and stuff like that, it's making a sacrifice for the next generation. And I feel like at the time we had to talk about context when she was talking to James Baldwin, because one of the words that she used was cracker. Like you can tell mm -hmm. the, the state and she was like, there's no hope. There's no, yeah. but I feel like in this current era, because they fought back then, we have more hope. You know what I mean? So I feel like it applied back then, but when you take it now, we've evolved from that mindset so that we can be transparent with our other. But I do mm -hmm. agree. It's just like, it's not fair that you are going out and being a different type of person to the world. And then when you come home. Mm -hmm. So I feel like instead of saying to flip it that way, is rather show the world who you really are. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, if you're going to be this at home, you should mm -hmm. be real, this person out there as mm -hmm. well. You know what I mean? Instead of focusing on the lie to me, don't lie to me, be real to everybody else. Yeah. So now at yeah. least at that point, I don't feel yeah. like it's I'm just, getting the back right, end of it right. in that capacity. But it's but like it's, at it's what hard. cost though, right. Right. you know? Because obviously yeah. if his boss is a cracker back in those times, sorry, if his boss is white back in those <laughs> times, uh, cracker, like, the, then, the, he, then he can't. Or he'll or he'll risk losing. Well, and that's why his... I said back then. But we, I felt like they fought so that today we can. But be I, more I think wrong. even I think if you want to go more broad, like even just like let's take out race, right? You know, sometimes your boss is just a prick. Dick. You know, yeah. a dick, a prick, whatever, like an asshole. And sometimes you need that job at that moment to take care of things. So I think like you have no choice. Sometimes it's a defense mechanism to smile in somebody's face when really you want to bash them upside the head. So I think what she's saying is if you can do that there, then you damn sure can do it here because mm. they're treating you like shit. I'm treating you good. So I, but, think, go ahead. I think my take on it is kind of like touching all three of y'all's, right? So I feel like in a, in a sense, definitely, um, it's like definitely I'm giving a, 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 another persona to the world, mm. but it's not that that's not that's not me. But mm. guess what? You know what else is me? Being human, make, making mistakes. And a lot of times us giving our emotions is a mistake. We don't like... That's us thinking under 
those situations, them cir- circumstances, isn't how we think for the most part, right? Mm-hmm. So if I'm hurt, if I'm rational. upset, yeah. So at, at a yeah. job, I might not give my, my boss my, my anger. You know what I'm saying? But at home, I feel more comfortable. I'm going to give my boss that anger. So I don't think it's being fake to the world. But again, at the same time, it's about a sacrifice, right? So I'm, I'm making a sacrifice until I can do what I want. So mm-hmm. I can't go out and give the world the real me because I'm not where I want to be yet. If I give them the real me now, I can't get there. It's harder to get there, if that makes sense. Yeah, I can work my ass off, but it's harder to get there. Sometimes we just got to smile until we can get to the top and tell to them our the story. Door, nobody, yeah. gives about, nobody gives a fuck about your story until you, somebody, you know what I'm saying? So I say to the same on both sides, right? So the sacrifice in a relationship, it can be the sacrifice of, you know, like a child. I'm, I'm sacrificing 10 years for my child. So when my child get older, he can be like, you know what? This is how I treat a woman. Why? Because my dad taught... Tra- tra- so my dad treated my mother like this, right? He didn't get upset and curse my mother out. This is what I saw from my family. That could be the sacrifice. Mm-hmm. The sacrifice from a job can be from me getting a promotion to me owning this motherfucker, right? It can mm-hmm. be a sacrifice in all aspects of it. And not to be broad, I kind of want to like never done because we are in a relationship. And there's been times where I told Shade like, yo, I don't like the pillow talk and I don't really do, right? But I talk to my girl because that's a close person to me. I don't, it's certain things that I tell my girl that I wouldn't tell nobody. It's yeah. like, even when it comes to the job aspect, I rarely, like, I feel like Shadi tell me about her job, whatever, but that's not really me. Like, I'll, like, when it comes to, like, letting my boss know what's going on, that ain't me. Like, yeah. I don't care. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I can't say I really don't care because I'll come home and tell my girl, like, yeah, like, they said this. Like, this shit dumb as shit. But you probably would never hear me say that on my job. Like, I wouldn't, I don't really complain on my job. Like, because yeah. I just don't give a fuck that much. Yeah. But I, I will tell it to Shadi. Is that fair for her? She had a long day, right? I come home, I'm telling her my, my problems. Well, she probably had problems of her own, right? Mm-hmm. So it's, I get it when it's saying lie to me. And even deeper than that, when we get to arguing, sometimes we can sacrifice that small moment. And the, um, T.D. Jakes was saying, what is the bigger, what is that? not the bigger picture. The, the mission. The mission, right? What's the mission of the relationship? And not even of the relationship. What's the mission of this argument? What's the mission of what we're going through right now? So even at times when we get irritated with each other, it's like, okay. What's the bigger picture? What's the bigger picture of me? Not even, because this is how we look at it. I, it's not me holding it in. It's just let me hold Com- it. Let it's me like hold off. It's like compartmentalizing it yeah, for a moment. Exactly. Let me hold. It's not even holding this, holding off. Let me hold off right now because I know how I will react in this moment. Let me come back later. Then we can have that conversation. That's sacrificing for the bigger picture. What's the bigger picture? Us, us communicating well, how, understanding how we react in certain situations. We know that if I get upset, I might, I might curse and say something to you that I just, that I, that I don't mean, that I might regret. You might get upset, curse, and say something that you don't regret. So it's holding off to the bigger. For the yeah, bigger we gotta, now, we gotta normalize. That, right? We gotta norm. We have to normalize um, conversations mm-hmm. and not arguments. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna add. We to gotta that. normalize that, but it's like. It's so hard because every day is the we're emotion. Something else. It's, yeah. Well, it's the yeah. it's the emotion, the right. emotional factor, and we're humans, right? And I think it just comes with a certain level of, of patience because I preach all the time. Like sometimes it'll be good, and you'll be able to do it. Other times, emotions are a little different, and you know there'll be different factors. So you can't really just do it that way. Mm-hmm. You would want to, and it's like you like to, you would like to, but sometimes it's just not as easy to do. But there'll be other times where it's easier to do. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like you know, and just even like. Compartment, uh, compartmentalizing, compartmentalizing you know your emotions like you know we all come from a long way and you, you we could tell everybody like yo I, I i'm i handle things way better now than i did i think we all can agree to say that like you know back then mm-hmm. i used to do with shit this way but now i handle things agree but we still have so much longer to go like where we could just do it consistently without having some type of setback on it yeah. you know what i mean it's just as human nature it's not the easiest but if we all can just come to some type of patience for each other, like sometimes it ain't going to be easy for you. Sometimes it ain't going to be easy for me. It doesn't mean I'm trying to drag you down or bring you down. It just really means that I'm, I have a long way to go, just like you have a long way to go. If that well, why, why, do you think, why do you think that we have such a long way to go? Like, wh- where do you think that comes from? So somebody told me, uh, I, I, heard, I heard a different take on something the other day, and I thought it was interesting. Somebody told me, like, you know, when we talk about our age, we have to understand that we shouldn't talk about our age from our age. Like, you know, you know, I'm 30. Right. But she told me, like, you really weren't really fully aware and started growing to who you are. So you probably was like 19, 20. She was like, so you're really 10. You get what I'm saying? And I thought about that. I'm like, wow, actually, we really don't have as much experience on life as we think we do. Yeah, you know what I'm like, saying? Because it's a human brain. Not, 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 I'm, not I'm, not I'm, hold on. Not. First, of all, I'm, first of all, I'm the oldest one on the set. So I know I I'm not Oh, here 10. you go. Just last yeah, week, you were the guess, same age, yeah, bitch. Yeah, but guess what? We're not anymore, bitch. So, uh, but what I'm saying is, no, nah, we all been through shit. We know life. Well, but technically, we still, I'm older than you because you're 10. <laughs> fuck off. So, what I'm, Tyler, 10-year-old. 
<laughs> right. Fucking kid. That was a 10 year old response. Yep, this bitch is 10. <laughs> that was a four year old response. <laughs> Congratulations, bitch. <laughs> like, and that's four Look, too. Fuck you, not <laughs> two. <laughs> exactly. Where you want to go. But my point is, like, no, we're not 10, obviously. I know. However, we still have so much more of life to learn. Like, you don't got it all together. You don't got it all together. I don't got it all together. You know what I'm saying? So to sit here and condemn anybody, like, oh, you should handle this or. You should like, first of all, nobody has it all together to tell anybody how or what way to deal with it. We all just have to have patience on how we deal. Like, you know what I'm saying? So what? what? I'm what laughing because I'm thinking about how immature we just got. Right. In the midst. Know, but that's my point. But that's my point. Like, we have a long Sally way to go. Laugh and she thought that no, I, mean, I heard you sigh. You said, <laughs> I mean, this sigh. Right, I was yeah, like, said, thank you. I can hear his fucking ass. Like, ass, like, ass. I got asthma. Like, that's an excuse. He likes to use that excuse. I've had the hookah mad long. So go ahead. And you're long just stronger than mine. I would hope so. Like, shit. Like, can I clear my throat? Yeah, one time I was brushing my teeth and, like, no. Like I was no. like, Shade says something like, "Whoa, I was I was tight." That's oh, because he was gagging. <laughs> I was brushing my teeth. I tried to get my tongue, and I was like, "Not what you doing the hand signal, right?" Bro. Come on, man. He, was, yeah. like, no, he was back there. Like I was like, Pause. back there. I mean, I was trying to, you know, saying, get the back of my teeth. You think he was trying to get his tonsils? Tongue. Yeah. You know what? <laughs> Can we get back on track? Shade was trying. He's that. ten. He's ten. Little... I told you he's ten. Shut. He just called me gay. Yeah. He's, like, he's like, you're gay. Shade was, <laughs> hey, was trying to get that little African dangly thing booty. in the back yeah, of his throat. Exactly. Well, anyway, listen. exactly. No, no, no. That is though. <laughs> so knowing that we don't know everything, right? Right. Why do you think people are so, so strong on like, or what's the fucking word? The the opposite of oh, close mind. Why why are people so close minded to getting help? Right, because if we know we don't know everything, right, and I'm giving you a new perspective, why is it always, nah, I know this, or you don't know everything? Why, why aren't we so? Why aren't we? Because open? like, I, well, I think also like, okay, you know how like a woman has a baby, right, and then it's like excruciating pain, whatever, whatever, and then you'd be like, oh, I'm never doing this again, and mm-hmm. then fuck around. Three years later, she's pregnant again. She's doing it again. I think like as humans, I think God gifted us with like the ability to forget certain things because if we held on to them and we weren't able to forget it, we would never do it again. Mm. So I think it's one of those things where like in the moment you don't think about that because had that, had you not even like, had you thought about it, but you, you probably wouldn't have gotten to that moment to grow. Right. Cause but, at some point you have to go through so right. about not knowing everything. Right. Right. Well, right. I also okay. think it's, I think it's closed minded to think that people are closed minded about it. I think that it's just that again, I think sometimes I don't want to take away for the fact that God gave everybody a pair of eyes to see different things. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes I feel like there's pride on both sides. Like sometimes Mm -hmm. it could be like, you're trying to tell me something to see just from your perspective. And I already know my perspective or vice versa. Like sometimes we do know things, you know, we don't know everything, but it doesn't mean we don't know some things about ourselves to be able to progress. So sometimes like Jazz says, you do forget certain things and you know, somebody does remind you or try to step in, but some things I do know, like I had a baby before. So if somebody tells me like, you don't know, I'm like, Something about a baby, like, excuse me, sir, I've had a baby. So, <laughs> like, you but, know what I'm saying? Like, but, well, it's certain things. Does, does it hurt you, right? Like, mm-hmm. yeah, you have had a baby before, and somebody might not have had a baby, right? Mm-hmm. But they, let's say they had classes or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. And they're trying to bring a new idea to you. Mm-hmm. And yeah, what you've done works, right? Mm-hmm. But if if he has something that's more efficient or not even more efficient, you wouldn't know if it's more efficient because you're, you're not open because one, you had a baby before. You're not even trying to listen to be open minded on what this guy have to say or if it can work because it works your way. It can, uh, again, I, I'm, I'm big mm-hmm. on. Two things can coexist in the right. same in the same realm. I just feel like as humans, we are so sh- we are so close minded to the fact that like somebody else can be right or we both can be right. I think it's a defense mechanism. Yeah. I think we're it's, we and, get defensive because so, a lot of us are scared to yeah. evoke certain emotions. So I think it's to protect ourselves. Sometimes we don't want to hear yeah. a different way or right. the right way because we're comfortable in the way we're doing it. And I also just mm. I was watching a show and something they said sometimes. Just because somebody is better than, so just because you may be better at something than somebody else, don't mean they can't teach you something. Absolutely. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's just something, um, you know, I just, you know, dawned on because at the end of the day, somebody doesn't have to know more than you to teach you something or know less than you to be able to be like, oh, you should do it that way. And I think that sometimes people are just know it alls. Like, yes. you know what I'm saying? Like, we are in that state, like, oh, I know this, I know that. So when somebody does give some intellect, it's like, I already know this, but. You know what I mean? It's just kind of like, you know, they still can teach you something. I was reading like a devotion this week and it was like about wisdom, right? Mm -hmm. And it was basically breaking down what wisdom is. And it's like, you might have the knowledge on something, but not know how to apply it. Uh, You know what I mean? And mm -hmm. that's when wisdom steps Mm -hmm. in. So you may not have the wisdom on how to, you might know everything about a particular topic, 
like finances or this, that, and the third. And you could teach somebody yeah. and they can go apply it, but you yourself yeah. can't do it for yourself. Yeah. So that happens a lot. Like we yeah. may know the right thing to do, but yeah. the wisdom on how, how to, to do, do it, it is something that we, right. we, we fall short or on. Or some right. of us just don't have the ability to do it. Like yeah. um, sports, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Somebody might know, to, somebody might be able to tell a quarterback how to throw the ball further, but he ain't got the arm to That's do it. That's why we got right. coaches and yeah. players. Yeah. Right. Because yeah. some coaches have never played a game in their exactly. life. Facts. Yeah. And even analysts, like some right. analysts can, they can talk and, about the game. Yeah, right. And, and I also think you it. have to find like a coach or a leader for you because not every coach can teach everybody. Like, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? It might have worked how you taught this person, but it doesn't, the way you're Work teaching you. somebody else, it doesn't yep. mean it's applying to them because they don't understand it your way or they don't learn that way. So you mm -hmm. also have to learn how people learn. But you know I, I definitely have to agree <clears throat> with Jay on this one for mm -hmm. sure. You have to be open-minded. Mm -hmm. Have to be. Yeah, you have to. You can't grow if you're closed-minded. No, nah, that's fact. Fact. But I also think like, now back to now back to disagreeing with everything he says. It's like no. I just also think Shade like, was on a verse. He's like, but I think no, no, that's not, no, no. I was gonna say, but I don't automatically deem people closed minded because I don't really feel like that's my place. Like you know what I'm saying? Because some things, it's like even still, I always have to check myself. Like because it's like at the end of the day, I could be trying to tell somebody something, but who says what I'm telling them is right either? It's not about. It's not about. Well, not I think it's about being open, and open right. to hearing. Yeah, it. That's exactly right. what I'm saying. And, and so it's not fine. about. It's not about my place of telling them. Right. It's about the place of. Even if I'm wrong, just being open to listen yeah. to what I'm saying. So it's not, I don't think, because you said I, it's not my place to call somebody not well, open minded. No, right. It's I, not, I don't think I would call somebody closed minded. However, I will try to give them an open mind on my, what I'm thinking as well. But I'm never going to be like, you're closed minded because you don't get what I'm saying. I don't think that's right. It's not Me about personally. getting what I'm saying. It's though. being even it's open about to receiving yeah. what you're saying. Let's no, yeah. not get it. Because you can I say something and, and, and disagree or not, yeah, and not be yeah. on the same accord. Yeah. But it's different when you're not even trying to hear it. Right. Yeah. No, and I agree with that. I agree mm. with that. I, I'm just, what I'm saying is, I guess, like, I think it's okay to give somebody another way. Well, it's okay to reject right, how but somebody I also wants to do exa something. Exa exactly. But, exactly. Gotta, but at least it's both. You, exactly. Right. I think exactly. he's just saying, but at least be open to yeah. hearing what they have yeah. to offer up yeah. because you never know what you're saying right. no to. And it could be the one little thing that could change right. and everything could mm -hmm. go right from there. But because you won't even hear this person out because you right. think that they don't have as much experience right. or they're lesser right. or whatever, you block yourself right. from achieving whatever it is you right. had set out to do. Right. Question. Shade. Yeah. So... Uh oh, it's if, gonna get if, interesting. If, 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 he changed um, his his seating stance. If, if you I don't give a fuck about his little seating stance. <laughs> Listen, you, I'm creating dramatic effect. <laughs> question: If you fuck with one of my friends, right? Oh lord, who wasn't <clears throat> Would you tell me? If Wait. I fucked with one of your friends? But let's say he's one of my associates. Associates, like, what do you mean? You know what I mean? I don't. My your answer, like, like, but I'm if asking I, if you him, fuck like, with one of my associates. Would you tell me? I know, I've told you before. He's not your associate though, like somebody you knew. You ain't you 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 only told me because I, I was making a little. But, I only but told, told him, but you. I told you. What are you talking but about? Like if, when if me and Jay first started talking. Right, so, hold so, on, hold on. Okay, so let's. When me and Fem first started, talking, I seen him about to work with somebody, and I said, "Whoa, whoa, whoa!" I didn't even know they were like on that. I was like, "Yo, I, you know what I'm saying?" Back, but you know what I'm saying. Back in the day, I fucked him and all this. And I all didn't, just relax, like. But I told him, like, so what you mean? I think I said something. But like, like what? You I mean? guess he's saying. Well, I guess until that point, she wouldn't have known that you exactly. two knew each so other. So here's the thing, too. I think niggas, niggas need to know, too. Like, you know what I'm saying? Some niggas are, they I cool everybody, niggas. they bros. Like, bro, like, what the fuck you want me to do? You bro with this nigga over here. You bro with that nigga over there. That's your bro. That's your bro. Not now it's going to be like, oh, she fuck with the bros. No, the fuck I didn't. No, everybody your fucking brother. Everybody your associate. Yeah. You, everybody, like, what? Like, that don't make sense. But so, I told you. I think basically... To just to be a little bit more, um, you know, man, clear bro. on the on so the, on the, the no, listen, listen on the what he's saying. Yeah, basically, he's asking you, would you tell him if you fucked with somebody that he was around or knew but wasn't that close with to the point where it's like, all right, we're gonna see this nigga every day, so I better let him know. Absolutely, I've told him though. What do you? I so tell me, is it somebody else you wouldn't tell me about who I did? Come on, <laughs> come on with it, because I told you. But you're not even around this nigga, but I, and I still told you. Okay, so was you would you tell somebody what, if if you was if you, if you was dealing with somebody <laughs> that same as that huh? cousin? Would you say it's coming to me now? Somebody, I'm like, what? And, 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 and he wasn't he wasn't as cool with the dude. Would you tell him? And you dealt with if he had mentioned or, him. Not even not even not, a, not even if he didn't mention him. If he didn't mention him, but you see him around. Go to hell. Respectfully, but you see they follow each what? other on Instagram. Like you see him no. follow each other on Instagram. No, no. You see you like no. You see comments. You see he like yeah. You know what I'm saying? So they start talking about you interaction or something in that no, 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 no. So here's the thing: if we were going, if I knew, if, liars. no, whoa, 
Joe, get your man. Bro. That is a big fucking reach. What's a, I feel like yeah, no. Exactly. He ain't let me let me let me get my answer. Let me get my answer. Let me get my answer. All right, wait, wait. All right. If I know that we're going to eventually be in the same room as this person, then yes, I'm going to say something. Now, if you just mention this person amongst conversation, no, because at that point, I don't know how well you know this guy, and I don't know who this person is. I don't know that man. Is. I'm sorry. To sorry that man. to that man. I'm sorry to that man. If I, I have no idea gonna, who that man is, at that point, it's like, all right, what is what is that? It's like, okay, so what did what did you what, what are you going to do gaining from it? What did you gain from this? What or what are you going to do with this information? Like, what is the purpose of this information? The last time that I did try some shit like that, it completely backfired on me. And it was, vi- the, 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 listen, so look, hold up. Nah, because I told this dude, he said, have you ever fucked with an NBA player before? Woo, woo, woo. So I'm like, uh, yeah, Did one. Fuck with, oh, it was one. Oh. Yeah, I only dealt with one you NBA player. Like, you, every time a girl, you got a times about three. We are, J. Cole told us that. J. Cole nah, can go to saying. hell. <laughs> 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 J. Cole said a lot of things I don't agree with. <laughs> no, but listen, I told the dude. But it wasn't just one, you lied. It was one. It was two. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bitch. Even I nah, can tell that lie. Hold on, I'm going to tell you why it was two. Because <laughs> one of them... What is the episode one of them, title? Like, nah, because hold up. Nah, nah, y'all got me out here looking crazy. All right, so the one... <laughs> Yo, you got you out here looking crazy. Nah, nah Jay, up Jay got on you out here looking crazy. Nah, Dad, one, of them, one of them was in the league, and then he wasn't in the league. So it's like, does it even count? Does it even count? It's a half and half. It's half. Yeah. So it's like, and me and him were never exclusive. Like we just was dealing with each other for the last seven years. Nope. <laughs> but the other guy, Wait, the, the other guy. Did you hear what the fuck you just said? The other no, guy. No, no. The other guy. Up, that's my side <laughs> joint. The other guy. We uh, were in a in a relationship wait, for a couple months. On. Excuse and me. Wait, the fuck seven up. years, a couple up. months. Thank you. Seven years. We that's my because oh, this no, guy. No, because this guy is just my friend for real. But but yeah, I, I, we have had sex a few times. All right, for seven <laughs> years. <laughs> all right, for seven years. But <laughs> so but this nigga that yeah. I met. Hold a few on. Months. So listen, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you. Let me tell you. Let me get to the point <laughs> because y'all interrupted me with all this bullshit. <laughs> the other guy, <laughs> I was bullshit actually banter. yeah, we were in a little like committed relationship for a couple months. So when the guy asked me. You know, he asked me up front. So I wanted to be honest with him. So I mentioned, I told him, yeah, I dealt with so-and-so. So he's like, oh, all right, cool. Like, that ain't about nothing. I don't know him like that. Woo, woo, woo. Who was it, James Harden? My no, God goddamn bitch. <laughs> right? I'm not even answering who it was. So <laughs> you can't tell me who it was? So listen, so me and the Michael guy, the it goat? was not Michael Jordan. <laughs> I so mean, shit, shoot for the stars. Y'all, I'm y'all, just saying, though, if you're going to go for the goat, like, I'm just saying, I mean. <laughs> oh, man. Was it John Wall? No, I didn't never dealt with no John Wall. You never dealt with John Wall and y'all no. in the same area? Okay, cool. No, I mean, I, I passed him in whatever, but I don't know him like that. I've never dealt with John Wall, all right? You passed him in, like, the, the hotel room? Or like, no, yeah, like, yeah, in the club. Like, okay, I've seen cool, him out. Cool. I, I know curious. who he is. I'm like, joking. Yeah, but I'm, no. Okay, so, whew. back oh, to so the you, point. <laughs> so you dealt with John Wall. What are we talking what? about? Okay, listen, can I finish? Yeah, go ahead, my bad. So, me and the guy, <laughs> we were ki- everything was cool between me and this guy. You know, I got into a point in my life where I started going a different direction and I had pulled back from him. And I guess he got frustrated because he couldn't get in touch with me. And he sent me a nasty message. <clears throat> and in the message, he said, is this the camera? <laughs> That's the camera. <laughs> yeah, you. <laughs> Motherfucker. Yeah, you said, <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not chasing you. I would never chase you. Why, why, why would the fuck would I chase a girl that let XYZ fuck. And it was the dude that I had mentioned. That in the, the names, man. Fuck that. Who and I'm like, that What's was, I'm like, that was What's so lame. So What's that deter, that deters me from telling the next person, oh yeah, so you know, you I that? did. Do that lame, put that nigga out there. Fuck that nigga. Put him out there. Who told you? Jay, we can't do that. What's that nigga name? We can't do Fuck that. Fuck that nigga. Do it. What's that nigga name? <laughs> Jay, chill. <All> right. <laughs> we got it. I'm like, chill. Any initial? Just one. No. Uh, right, no, fine. but listen, the point is, that was not cool. So yeah, that's why sometimes you use it against, use yeah. it against me. So yeah. it's like, why would I tell the next person if I know that they might not know them? What's the point that's until fair. it comes up? So let's 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 reel it in for a second. <laughs> his hands together. Not, the bird man, not right. to that extent, right? But I feel like some things shouldn't be said because even in the moment, because we are immature as adults or um humans at, in that moment, it will get thrown, get thrown in our face. Me yeah. Shade, for example. Okay. Like what? Plenty of times. One of us then said something, and when we got in the argument, we threw it in the. In, okay, in fair enough, fair enough. 
Um, Give a direct example. So can I ask you like, something? I will. So oh, 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 have okay. you have you you've told me about every girl we in the room with that you smash? Hell no. Oh, I just wanted to. And I'm gonna tell you I'm why curious. not. Because I, I started curious. to go that route, and it backfired. That's what we she said. That's what she said. Right. So, so me and Shani, said. Like, that's what me she and Shani said. was having a conversation. We even said say the name, and we was having conversations about um, what would you like? Because we were talking about traits, right? And 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 and, and um, zodiacs. And she was saying that uh, Gemini's lie or whatever, Gemini or whatever like that, right? Gemini. So, right. So, and I'm like, no, nah, I don't think we lie, but we do. It's a, yeah, omit. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So and I'm being, fair, I'm being fair. I'm being fair. At least I'm going to give you the truth because she ain't going to give you that. So I'm saying, so I'm like, you know what? So I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, it's not that, it's not that That's I'm a liar, but if I don't feel like it's important, I'm not going to bring no it up. You have no hair, sweetie. So look, so look, so look, <laughs> she's like, she's like, I'm like, if, if I don't think it's important, I'm not going to bring it up. So she was like, like what? So I'm, th- I'm telling her things that I might not have thought that was important. It was one of the chicks that, you know what I'm saying, that, that happened. And I told her, and she just go bat shit. It was just <laughs> like, eight shit. It was just, it's like, it went I don't from, think girls can take true. that. That's not true. Make- that's not what happened. What, I, the, what you talking about, I ain't, that's not how that happened. <laughs> but we ain't going to do that. But, however, what I will say is, to his point, he says, some things ain't serious. But what he said was serious. See, it's a difference. I feel like to there's you, levels. Not to me, though. But there's levels. So Just you like can't to her. If it, to, when she yeah. told right. her that it wasn't serious to her, but and to him, he was hurt. But that's fine. But when you do, you do have, you have a risk that once you say it, it might be serious. So to just me. like she like, was like, just like G- Giovanni, what's her name? Nikki just like Nikki Giovanni said, la. No, nah, like, that's not what she said. That's not what Nikki Giovanni said. You see how that's not what she said. No, 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 no. This is what, that's why I can't say it's not nice, bro. Because they twist, they turn. Yeah, he's like, yeah, so lie about who you fuck like Nikki Giovanni said. Like, what? She didn't say that. Don't put that on my queen. She didn't say what I'm about to say. Don't put that on that queen. Some things like, why put that extra stress in the room? Period. Not not lie. I'm not saying lie. Yeah. Uh, of course. Well, omit the truth. Lie. Right. Why put that extra stress in the room? It's, so it's like, if yeah, it, if I in agree. The room, right. And it's a random chick that you so happy to got cool with. Why would I be like, nah? You know, I used to fuck wrong, her, right? Wrong, wrong, wrong. Yeah. If I get cool what? with her, you know what? If I get cool with her, that was bad. you that was bad, bad motherfucker. You know what? Not Never. Cool, cool, Even cool. in the beginning stages, though, it can it can kind of like change how you view somebody. Yeah, because right. it's like, oh, uh, you ain't that special. Right, so and so got it. Yeah, like, real so shit, real shit. Because like, now, because if I know certain bitches, I'm like, I ain't fucking with because I know I'm not above her. Because once you see a nigga fuck with a bitch uglier than you, it's like, yeah, it's like, so who are you really? Like I said, it might be times where like 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 we be in a room. And I might have smashed the girl across the across the um the hall, hall? Or whatever it is called, the room across the room. And I'm like, hey, babe, you see her? I fucked her. Why am I introducing that negative energy in the search for nothing? It's <laughs> not damn well. Like, that's not how it happens. No, no, I, no, I agree no, with that. Wait. I agree with that. But what you're not about to have have these bitches sister. Hey, smile sis, in my face. Hey, sis. But, love you, sis. On, yeah, because oh ain't, no ain't, ain't, no, ain't, no ain't, ain't no bitch about to sis me. Yeah, ain't no bitch about to sis me that had my man's dick. Come out. Because they do that a lot. Oh, yeah. Come out. You can jump it's off of a bridge, no, no, bitch. Listen, Kill yourself, ho. Run in front of a train. You, if a bitch says, I'll, matter of fact, bitch, give me the listen, wheel. <laughs> if a girl, not a bitch, I'm sorry. If a girl says you, I still Oh, now they ain't bitches. No, listen. Wow. If a girl says you, if a girl says you, it's still, wow. it's still none of my, it's still none of my business to tell her, tell you what happened. Now, if you, in return, sis her back, then it's my job. But if everybody be like, Repost. Oh my God, I love y'all. Re- I'm not about to obey the girl that just reposted you ten, ten slides ago. I smashed her. Oh, the other chick that was like, <laughs> Oh no, that I, I, I need to know. That I need to know. I need to know that. I need to know that. I'm gonna tell you why. 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 You see how you see that dear and Ken shit? The yeah. bitch who he was fucking with was retweeting them, posting mm-hmm. them, all that. And that's the same bitch he got caught cheating with. So don't play with me. You better fucking tell me if these bitches is over here sissing me and all this shit because them bitches be. Fans and we'll fuck your nigga. Yep. Anyway, okay, like I period. said, as long as you, I think, look, look. I think my, my perspective, it only becomes light, light. my. Matter of fact, only, you know it, what? It only becomes <laughs> high. I'm fucking high. Nah, because listen, here's the thing: you're not gonna, you're not gonna make me look stupid. So if it's a, if it ever comes to a point where you better tell me this and deal with my shit versus me looking stupid. You First have to take the L because yeah. I'm not looking stupid. When it comes to that, I'm not looking stupid. To when it comes to telling you shit that I don't want to tell you. Because I feel like if you right, make like, me look stupid, <laughs> there's no coming I back from that. I, 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 now, if you fuck some bitch that's not on my level before me, okay, you know, I didn't but, know you. But we you, we can't come back from you having me out here looking stupid. No, what I'm saying is if she's, it's different. If she sisses you, right? Like that's her posting, like, I'm, you need to let me know that I, I fuck that bitch because I know nah, for a fact that you ain't my nah, sis. Nah, no, what I'm saying is if you, if you sis her back, for example, but I, I got it. If you sis her back, then of course. But, I'm but a, everybody. Here's the thing I don't think niggas realize what you're trying to say. I get it 100%. But see, you don't know females. 
and it don't yeah, apply for females. See, the thing is, I've said to people tons of times, pe- females are very catty, very vindictive. They do it on purpose because they want to see how long you'll let them do it without stopping it. And they'll keep doing it until they prove a point. Right, cool. There's a lot of women out here, and that's what I be trying to tell people. I don't fuck with none of that shit. Like, I'm not your okay. sister. We ain't blood. So don't wait, let's me. just vice Straight versa up. real quick. So say a nigga repost something you did and mm-hmm. be like, shout out to the bro, woo woo. Mm-hmm. Now, if you find out that he's fucked her, that's not going to make you. Again, again. You oh, won't be like, no, no, I'm no, no, that no. shit fucked his stomach up just right there. <laughs> it was a good. Right. He can't breathe. Yeah, yeah, can I, you have no uh, hair for me. No, so again, <laughs> one, one and two. One and two. Can I have a. Can I have a. Let me know what y'all do. Don't play like that. <laughs> oh, now it's not, don't now play like don't play that. like that. Play now like y'all can't that. breathe. I didn't say that. You I said, said it. it. I said it. I said what I said. Ask me the question, but I ain't answer it yet. All right, Again, go ahead. Go ahead. So what I'm what I'm saying is, nah. <laughs> if if right. <laughs> so if that's like, nah, I'm gonna fuck, shoot him. Even answer the question, like yeah, okay, okay. So listen, again, if a nigga fucks you, right? Any 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 reposting me? One. A nigga don't have to re- a nigga don't have to repost me for me to find out you fucked up and be mad uh, at all. Period. That's me. That's who I am. He don't have to do shit to me. I can see the nigga walking in the street. Like, I fucked him and be pissed. Like, don't tell me that shit. He <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't have to say hi to me. So one, that don't. I mean, just to me, I just feel like it's bad. Listen, time. my two, friend hurt uh, her, a, a nigga she knew died. Okay, <laughs> and. Her but, nigga got mad because she was sad that the nigga died because she fucked him before. Is, all I'm saying is, all I'm saying is, wait, is that wait, wait, question? That's insane. yeah, that's nigga. Right. Question. Yeah, what's up? Like, so, okay. so let's talk so, about like, it. So, so honestly though, right? If I'm not bro, if I'm not cool with the nigga, you don't have to tell me. Now, if you see me engaging with this nigga back, yeah, let me know because then. So you telling me right now that. These bitches ain't come since me. I engage with them because I'm a nice bitch to a degree, right? I'm not a friendly bitch, but I'm a nice bitch. So because I be in Jay's element, there's sometimes that girls come over. Hey, sis, you look good. I'm like, oh, how you doing? To be nice. So you telling me none of them bitches. You yeah, fuck. they did. He did. He's lying. I already I already seen it. He's yeah, lying. you're not, not a lie face. I, I know I'm not lying. Like if you ask me a question, I'm asking. You're just omitting the truth. I'm trying okay. to think. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> ain't nothing to think about, Jay. <laughs> nah, it is. I mean, <laughs> I mean, it's something to think about. Uh, uh, uh. All right, <laughs> sorry, sorry. but wow, now that's crazy. I'm saying it's something to think about. But, At least I'm being honest. I just feel like this is why. I used to fuck <laughs> this. <laughs> but anyway, no, 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 no. Honestly, um, I don't think so because I've told her most of them. Most, no, so, no, so, but no, not all. No. You have, first of all, you told me a dent to him. Like, stop it. A dent? Stop. Not even a dent. dent. Nigga, if this is a table, he told me this <laughs> right here, this corner, this corner. That's not true. Honestly, that's not true. So I say this. How many bitches do you think you smashed at Morgan? What? Did I ask a nigga that? Why? <laughs> I'm at, I mean, Go ahead. I'm not about to ask you your body. You ask me my bad I'm body not, count. Not, it don't matter. Okay, right, you know what's matter. funny? Don't matter. Jay, Jay Love count. said, nah, me and my bros used to smash all the bitches at Morgan. We used to do all that. Wow. And, and, and what do you, like do you no, think no. happened to those bitches? You think they perished into thin air? So, after right. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> they are still around. They're honey. still around, and so, they had all his parties. Not really, not true. Right. Now, not what truthfully. I will say is, no, no, no. no. All right, so we changed the question. So now what? I wanted to ask this: Is a difference now? Okay, no, flirting? No, no flirting. <laughs> oh wow, <laughs> nigga, you are done. Go ahead. I'm saying like <laughs> flirting with in a DM, right? Is different from like fucking a chick. Now I don't think I've ever like. I don't think it was a girl I fucked and she been in our presence and you ain't know. I don't think. But bitches you flirted and tried to get at was in my Yeah, that, I mean, yeah. Now, but that didn't go through. So it's like, it didn't count. But that bothers me. And it just, bothers me too. Bothers me. That, bothers that almost me too. bothers me more. Right, just like, because it's like, like this bitch? hold up. So this bitch couldn't get you, but you no. got me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you couldn't get this bitch, but you got me. Hold Why up. I dubbed you? Yeah, Why yeah, you? Yeah, this bitch ain't even me. Hold up now. I got to do some. Like I got to go so back to win. the drawing so board. Like, sometimes win. it don't be a dub. No. It's just not no. enough time. It don't be a dub. It's just not, not no, enough time. No, because honestly, I'm going to be real with you. you if I seen my man, like, the, the, uh, I'm a jealous it. bitch when I care about a nigga. So, like, if I were to see my nigga shooting his shot at another bitch and get blocked. bro. That should make you. And I'm going to be like, oh, my God. She didn't fall for that bullshit line. But I know. Oh, my God. So, what's wrong with me? Right. My DM. And she seen one of the DMs. She tried to say that. She thought it was last month. Hold on, 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 hold on,
out of here. Jada still, nigga Joe was like, when I'm going like, to see you, she was like, whenever you're ready. Exactly. That's not a joke. <laughs> you know what, what you're that means. About. That's whenever you're ready. And I ain't never talked to that bitch since. She ain't say, she ain't say, don't play with me. Or, I ain't never let that bitch do my nails. It said, whenever you're ready. What you talking about? But see, I don't forget. I don't know. So you were sending whenever you're ready? What? All right, I ain't get dubbed. Don't play with my name. I mean, I, when I say whenever you're ready, you ready, it means you got dubbed. He mad. it means that I'm not really setting a date on this because it can happen exact, whenever. But whenever, I'm not really. It can happen whenever I want. If I wanted to press down, it could have happened, but I did. Right. Yeah, right. but I would rather. I think yeah, I would rather. Like, if, it, if I if I liked you, I'd be like, come get me right now. I would. Yeah, I would be like, what's up? Right now. What you waiting for? Where you at? <laughs> It's on you. So I got a question. Let's, let's go. <laughs> nah, but like on some real shit, I would rather like I would have more peace of oh, mind knowing that my nigga actually fucked the girl, then shot his shot and and didn't it didn't go through. So, but here's a question, right? Say I don't know the nigga, right? Never met the nigga. We out in an engagement. Nigga see you, and he come up to you and try to have an you. Engagement. Gonna tell me? You gonna tell me? Wait, wait, time out. Wait, nah. Hey, girls <laughs> lying. You know why? Because girls don't have even the nigga she's talking about, right? Girls, this I used to mess with him. Nah, tell me if you fucked the nigga. Cause like, like, you want me to say I fucked her? Cause in a, in a nigga mind, in a nigga mind, right? In a nigga mind, I ain't fuck with none of these bitches. I'm gonna tell you I fucked her, right? But in a girl mind, yeah, I used to deal with him. I used to talk to him. Did you fuck him? Or not? <laughs> you know that's nigga, the verb. I used to talk. I used to talk. Right? Even sensitive. the nigga she talked about, she was like, yeah, cause we used to deal with each other. Like, did you fuck him? I that's why I automatically think, yeah, you fucked that nigga. He probably all on his dick. <laughs> Jasmine. <laughs> Yes. And I'm doing it. Yeah, Alex, and I'm, I'm interviewing a nigga like, hey, my, the real question I want to know is like, yo, when you fucked my bitch, how was it? But I'm asking the nigga like, yo, so when it like, so when you was dropping your tape, like, what was the process in the studio? Nah, fuck I'm that. I'm so small. I'm so when not small minded, but I'm pussy. I'm, I'm, like, that's, what I, that's what I really want. I'm to so ask. childish because like, I do don't be tell taking, me no more. Don't like, tell me shit. And for me, <laughs> honestly, what's <laughs> up with this guy? Whoever's dude, out this there, this guy is wild. Who, whoever, <laughs> whoever's out, wild, whoever's bro. next on my list, lie to me because then I'm gonna want to know like, did you fuck her the same way you fucked me? Was it as good? Did you do right. this for her? Did you do that for her? Were you talking well, picture, to her? I'm the one interviewing you... the nigga, so I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. Like, yo, so. <laughs> so, like, was it easy to get her? Or, like, was it, like, did you have to work for it? Like, did you really talk to her? You know you what know, sucks? And, what was the process? You know what sucks? With, you know what sucks as females? Like. She's quiet. Now, nah, because listen. I'm listening to your this banter. Is what, this is what. <laughs> banter. So I wonder if I ask him. I wonder if I ask him, yo, did y'all really talk? Or did this you just fuck him? He used to love me. He used to love me. Fuck no, you mean. Yo, and, and Al Mind. He used to love me. Oh, anybody who fucked me. Anybody who been here loved to hear. Fuck yeah, you talking about. Yeah, that's all. I can. If a nigga didn't love me and he fucked, ex- he loved me after. <laughs> <laughs> but I will say this. <laughs> It, yeah, after that, it's like it's just and, typical, and he was the one like I knew you talked to him because I seen stalker. it in his eyes when he came and told me. I know you seen that twinkle in his eyes. I ain't gonna hold y'all one time. So one time, oh you don't like it now? Look, look, look. now you quite, now you quite, now it's not, now it's all this. Wow, now but he look, just like I want to know when I was hold up, wait, you fuck her did with your only because we got a cool pussy. business relationship. I ain't gonna say nothing. Hold up, so look, one time my nigga came to town, right? You know who it was, we and cool we went to his, so we went to there. look, we went to his hosting, so. The nigga who worked there, I had fucked. So I swear I never would have. I ain't about to say all that. I never would have thought that he would have peeped. What are you that. here for? We can't get no name. Fuck out of here! You ain't drop no name because your business relationship. I can tell a nigga name. I don't give a fuck. I mean, I, 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 I mean, I can tell you who I was right. with, but look, I can't tell. You. I can't tell you the guy. I fucked. Like, <laughs> all right, so look. Quite a blow. <laughs> so he was like, so when we left, he was like, hey, "You fucked uh with so and so, didn't you?" And I was like, "Huh." No, what? Why would you say that? Nah, I seen the way he looked at you and the way he looked at me. You are tripping. I was like, you are straight hey, tripping. So you lied. Story. Since, 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 since y'all give because me that right? was just something so you, I would have never since, thought so would have happened. So, you <laughs> so since y'all so don't want to give me nothing, I'm going to give y'all something. Right? So you lied. Though. You know I did her? lie. You know oh, okay. So imagine, look at Because I'm like, uh, how did the fuck could he have? I didn't imagine, see that. Imagine a nigga being in a position that you want, right? Oh, I ain't going to say looking shit. up to Because I don't really look up to too many niggas, right? But let's just say borderline look up to, right? So I'll never forget. It was a nigga that like hosted like this basketball uh <laughs> shit. And I ain't even gonna say what because y'all gonna know who who, who it is. It, I'm gonna say it was some basketball <laughs> shit, right? Oh no, say N- no. <laughs> I got no say. I mean, no no say it. So, so, so I'm gonna fuck the nigga Rodney, right? I, he used to host for the uh for the Wizards, right? Swear to God. So I, I always wanted that position. So I would try to reach out to him to try to get game. You know what I'm saying? Like I was a young I'm, I was a young nigga. I wanted to reach out to him to find out how he got got game. 
Found out my ex bitch fucked him. I was like, I never hit him again. I was like, the fuck? Like, I never hit that nigga again. Fuck that position. Fuck the words. It's all that. I tried North Carolina. Like, that shit <laughs> fucked that nigga up, man. <laughs> like, nah, because you know what? Because he was good at that I'm shit. I'm a look, my friend, anyways, my friend literally just, I swear to God, my friend literally just told me the story on a plane the other day. He was like, man, he said his ex girlfriend, she was like a social media girl, right? Mm -hmm. And he was like, it was this other girl who was on social media, but she wasn't big like his girlfriend. But he did fuck. Or no, she sucked his dick one time. But oh, he was wow. like, but they, even... stay, but they stay cool oh, after, but it never happened again. So he said that they were Damn. in the, they were, they were out of town. And he was like, it was like a random coincidence. The bitch was there. So basically, <clears throat> he had told, the bitch had a bathing suit line. So he got the bathing suit line for his girl that he was oh. with for her to endure. Listen. Hey. Fuck I that, was man. like, you would have like been dead. dead. Hey, hey, listen. He had. I don't give a fuck about like niggas gonna have me on here looking like Tony the clothes and like a nigga fuck my bitch. Nah, nah. It was before man, me. That listen. Was before me. It wasn't when we was together. <laughs> fuck both of them niggas. Hold up, listen. No, this was before the, him and the girl got Make together. That clear. But this is my point. He had her. He was. She was like, oh, you think your girl could wear the bathing suit? Woo woo. And he's like, well, they were going on a yeah. He was like, but they were going on a trip, so it was kind of convenient. So he was like, all right, cool. So he had her wear the bathing suit to promo it. Oh, and wow. this girl has sucked his dick. And see, that's the type of shit right there. I'm like, nigga, wait, you would be dead. Wait, 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 You'd be dead. You would be dead. I'm not endorsing this bitch. No, listen, listen, when a girl suck oh. a nigga dick and you uh, with him, it's different. Because it's like, man, that bitch used to suck my dick. But when you suck the nigga dick, and it ain't the same because now I got to think about you sucking No, dick. it's the I, same thing. I'm not putting on no clothes for no bitch who sucked my nigga's dick. Like, I'm not in, I'm not promoing nah, your shit. it's different. Like, your you wouldn't even have got me to nigga, wear this shit nigga, if you didn't nigga, know my nigga. You wear a different pride on your sleeve. Like, yeah, you sucking my nigga dick. It ain't, it's different. Mm. Nah, it's different. Listen, yeah, we can't no. ignore the, wait, hold up, hold up. We can't ignore the double I'm standards. We can't out. ignore it. We can't. I agree. All I'm saying is, now, you as agree. a nigga. I do. Hell no. This is why I'm scared. To Hold commit, because yes. you can't trust as a nigga. This is my nigga, toxic right? side. As a nigga, if my girlfriend sucked the nigga dick, I'm thinking about that day in, day out. But as a woman, right, and your nigga got his dick sucked, mm. my bitch is like, this bitch ain't nothing. She's just sucking my nigga dick. Yeah, because see, girls, like, I don't know. So can we, I'm like, can I can only speak for myself. We, I ain't just out here sucking so dick. So can we, so, so, if wait, I suck so, your dick, so, then so, so, so can we, we can might we be getting married. Yes, we can All on right that then, one. So right. But but small I'm still victories. but I still but I still, small but, I still but I still need to know. I'm not you need to know I'm not putting on nothing for no bitch who sucked your dick still. Regardless. Now I'm not jealous of it cuz it's now, like, what that, bitch, But what if it's lit? Then she can die. <laughs> if that shit lit, you won't wear that I'm shit. putting the fire out. Crazy what you want to say? But I'm gonna just leave it to myself. Then, they got a story too. Fuck, she was about to say a story. You want to tell stories and shit. No. All I'm yeah, saying you is, do. Yeah, you do. All, <laughs> all I'm saying said is, I had a great I'm birthday. Girl, I'm gonna just girl, stay on the energy. All I'm saying is, if a girl sucks your nigga dick, that's a victory for you. Disagree. I don't want nobody touching my niggas anything. I don't yeah. even want a bitch touching his beard. I don't care if she was a fucking even if it's the old, best though. barber even, even if, in. Even if it's old. Before I don't, you. Before you. <laughs> like you're virgin. I'm sensitive. <laughs> and I'm jealous. My niggas are Not me too. I so lie. I don't want to know if about you me nothing. Too, I, think, well, I don't even know. I'm trying to go up in his house. Yeah, me too. What's up? We here. Yeah. Just run in that bitch. Yeah, be because like, I feel like this. I can never. Now I can't get it out of my head because now I'm going to be comparing. And like you say, comparison is the thief of joy. Fuck it. I don't want to be comparing myself to the last bitch because it's just going to be a result in me going crazy. But I think, see, for women it's different. For men, even if I don't like it, I'm still going to, for, for me anyway, it's like, even if, I, if I'm uncomfortable with it, I'm still trying to do my best to outdo him. Just be honest. That's just me. Yeah, so but like, it's like, I don't want to be in a relationship and, and, and it's based on me trying to one-up somebody. Jay's such a competitive But that's nigga. just me. I get up with her. She yeah, did, men do that. She, she, as a, she as a woman, lit, so I'm like, yeah, I, like I want my man to be, Word. I want nah. my man to be well, sacred. You, you know what yeah. I'm saying? I want it to like, be like, all like, mine. Like, not like that. It's dope, man. It's a good thing. It's out of love. Anyway, let's move on. Let's we had fun with that. Hey, that was lit. That was lit. <laughs> let's let's go to um. Let's see. Uh, um, fuck Donald Trump. He done. Goodbye. Shout out to that. He, he like done. like he lost like four times. Yeah, I don't. Okay, we still want to keep bringing it to the court. Yeah, you're, you're done, son. You did. It's we're gonna, over. We're gonna go to uh, Ken and Deere. Yeah, let's go. Let's go into that. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Let's rewind. Oh, I'm let's sorry. Let's rewind. Public. Um, Bro. let's let's rewind. Uh, go up. PS Five. Let's get this shit out of the way real quick. Matter of fact, we're gonna let's go to public. Me this is all over the place. Where are we going, guys? <laughs> right, we might not get to the rest of it, but fuck it, fuck it. Me and Shadi, where we at? All right, that.
Me and Shade. Yes. How do you feel about having your relationship in the public? Um, so I mean, I feel like we don't really put things out there OD. Like we're pretty transparent people, but we're not like on social media doing the most. Like when it comes to like our business, like we're on each other's social media. We're on cameras in these motherfuckers. What are you trying to say? We talk about our problems every week. No, I know that, but I'm talking about like in terms of okay, okay that's fair. But no, I mean, I'm, so they fuck off. Yeah, y'all do. Because know. what I'm saying is like in terms of like even like what we're going into. Like for example, we are not like bashing each other and going back and forth on the social media. We don't never do that. I mean, I blocked you a couple of times, but we ain't really. Yeah, but the, you know what I'm saying? That's bitch shit. Like. Y'all not JT and Uzi. Yeah, but we're not like, fuck that bitch, fuck that nigga. Like, okay. that nigga better never rah, rah, rah. You know what I'm saying? So we nobody really. Yet. I'm never getting there because I don't even got time. Yeah. Hey, look, we me, we keep it play on yeah. this side. You feel we, what I'm saying? I don't, I don't do keep play. I'm offset on this motherfucker. I'm pulling up <laughs> to the concert. Like, yeah, what's up? <laughs> this day. Well, go ahead. I'm sorry. But so I feel like, you know what I'm saying? For that's the most part. Who, that's one thing you don't ever do. <laughs> oh, shit. It's working. So. Like, in terms of, like, I feel like, you know, our relationship is public, but we're not, like, on the podcast, a lot of times, even when we're talking about our situations, we've already discussed it, and we already got through it. Like, we're not on social media, like, going back and forth, whatever. So, for the most part, like, we always good, and I feel like that's something my mom always taught me, like, y'all good. Like, you know what I'm saying? You don't really need to, like, niggas don't need to know when you're not good, but fortunately for us, we do tell people when we're not good, but we already overcame it, and we found our lessons, and we talk about it, and we work through it, and then we go ahead and give the solutions and the conclusions and things like that, but we're not out here, like, you know what I'm saying? Fuck that nigga. That nigga better never come home tonight because I swear to God, I'm locking the doors. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm all home that. I'm already. Unlocked. I'm about to start doing it though because. <laughs> Wait, what? I bet I'm about I'm be, to start I bet that. I'm about to through the balcony door. Like. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got to show y'all this video. I'm hitting the Maya like, like I'm about to open the door. Okay. <laughs> it means to but, end. Um, but outside of being public, like now, nah, like I feel like it's the difference between being public and, you know, <laughs> Having all your business out there. I don't think we're that type yeah. of. But I feel like, all right, so what we talking about, we talk, we, uh, yeah. one of the examples was De'Ara and Ken. Right. So I guess Ken cheated on De'Ara. Mm -hmm. Allegedly. They allegedly. saw her. That nigga cheated. Yeah, he cheated. Whoa, oh, whoa. Y'all can't just put that man. I just say you allegedly. Know? You don't know shit. You, you, he cheated on her with you? Nah. All right, then. Fuck is you talking about? So you can't say he didn't. He, he cheated. cheated. You don't know that. They, they, it's, was it's he multiple. in your box? He said, wow. So don't say he Do cheated. You want what? To envision? Let, where you go with that? Just relax. Like, that doesn't even be, say anything. Want, it should be no. That's it. Do no. you want? Like, what are you talking about? I'm saying, do I you want to pain. even? Envision, <laughs> do you want to even envision that? Because you said it so like freely. No, I'm saying if he wasn't in your box, don't say what he was doing. In another the nigga, nigga cheated. In another bitch box. He cheated. I think he cheated. Wow. He cheated. I don't anyway. think that was his first time cheating. I've read it on a yeah. couple of. All right. So all I'm saying is he's a cheater. Yeah. A bitch. You. A bitch. What you're saying? Yeah. Yeah. So all I'm saying is I don't know what the fuck. <laughs> what are you trying to say, Jill? Um, I'm about coming up, nigga. I said, J. What are you talking about? What? What nigga name I was about to you call you? Jahil. Hey, you're cr <laughs> Jalil. You're Jalil. crazier than Jalil me. Jalil Beats. <laughs> <laughs> you fuck Jalil Beats. It's like, but nah, nah, nah. Wow. For the record, I've never <laughs> fucked Jalil. <laughs> Why? Go ahead. But I, I think that's what comes with it. <laughs> and I feel like we was having this conversation yesterday. I feel like when you're a, a couple in public. You gotta uh -huh. deal with those things of people having something to say, people um accusing you of doing things that you right. might not have done, people even seeing you and just having their own opinion of yeah. it. I feel like with that we gotta be careful because we were talking about it yesterday, like even us, right? Yeah. Even given our problems to the public, we gotta be careful because some people look at us in ways for motivation. Some mm -hmm. people look at us in ways of like inspiration and, and mm -hmm. things like we're on a step, a, a pedestal, a pedestal. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And what happens is once you give them too much, they look at you like you're normal, mm -hmm. and it's like, what do you want? Mm. You know what I'm saying? Do you want to be normal or do you want to be idolized? Idolized. You yeah. know what I'm right. saying? So it's like, at that point, what do you want? So we was having a conversation I, yesterday mm -hmm. and I feel like it was good, but I feel like I ain't getting the energy, same energy from yesterday. So I'm trying to figure out <laughs> what happened. We, so the energy was good. We I didn't a get a chance to talk yet, but I got right, energy. That's what I'm saying. You know, I'm all, I always got the energy. So, okay, this is how I feel about it. I think that this is a young couple. You feel me? I think that they make their money off of their public relationship on YouTube. Mm -hmm. And I think that when you're young, you fall in love and you think it's forever. Mm -hmm. And I think that majority of the times that does not, that's not how that plays out. Now, this is a new generation and our generation, 
you know, we was we was on that love shit too mm-hmm, when we was younger, mm-hmm, and mm-hmm. then it didn't work out. But it's mm-hmm. like because that's how they make their money. It's almost like can they cut it off? Even if he really is unhappy, and that well, obviously, he's, if you're cheating, I believe that obviously you're unhappy. I don't care what anybody says, you're unhappy. So that's not true. I wait, no, hold on, hold on. I think that wait, you're wait, unhappy. No, no, no. I'm they not said, saying no. They that's 26. true. Nah, she's true. Nah, she she got a point. She got a, a point. New generation but, though. But you well, know that young. But no, they're like 18, right? Nah, they're no, 26. No, 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 you say that. Oh, they're 26? That's why I said it. Okay, but 26 even, I feel like this is a little bit younger than us. And I think that even they had more access to social media and shit like that in high school and stuff like that. You got to remember, when I was in high school, there was no iPhone yet. You know what I'm saying? It was sidekick and shit like that. That's so nice. they were able to record themselves and, and, and get online and do all this extra shit. And I think that that's how they make their money. So... If you're unhappy, but this is the bulk of your money, can you really walk away? No. So what do you do? You start to cheat. But but it wait. got caught. Now, if he never got caught, this wouldn't even be a conversation. He wasn't trying to get caught. You feel me? So because they're at public, it's a catch-22 because that is how he got caught Shout because somebody recognized him. You know no point saying? intended. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> somebody recognized him. You feel me? But that doesn't take away from the fact that, you know, that he really was doing something in his normal, regular life. You know, it, well, he wasn't filming at that, mo- at that moment. So that's something he was doing in his real life. For all we know, his bitch is done with him too. And they got to keep this up to get this money. But what I was going to say is, I don't agree with that because one, I, I agree what you're saying, but kind of not because you don't have to be unhappy in your entirety, in your entire relationship. I didn't say entirety. Right. I said no. you got to be unhappy not though. Right. You're so unhappy moment, about something. It could have been something that she was unhappy or it could be immaturity because you could be, it's not that you're unhappy. It's just, you don't know how to deal with your feelings that something, something might hurt your feelings and you just don't, you're not mature enough to deal with it on your own. Right. So it's not even unhappiness. And then when it goes into like them being together, um, not together, I feel like this is the conversation that I wanted to have. A lot of times, even outside of a public relationship, when you introduce something um, important, or I don't want to say important. When you introduce something more than yourselves into anything, now it's it's harder to walk away. For yeah. example, a child. It don't have to. It don't have to be a public relationship. It could be a child. You can have a, a child, and then a lot of times it's like, all right, you know what? This is bigger than us. It ain't just about us, right? Yeah, you cheated, or yeah, you hurt me. A lot of times we see this, and, and niggas don't want to uh, admit it. Apartments, houses. You got a lease on somebody. You got you got a lease with somebody, and now it's like, damn. It hurts you mm-hmm. more to yeah. separate exactly. than it does. Of course, to, right? To so try I to work it out. It's cheaper to keep her. Right, but I don't. I mean, yeah. <laughs> but it ain't came I, from nowhere. They, yeah. Right, yeah. but I don't think that. Uh, I I think more times it's what you have to lose in being unhappy, though. Honestly, but see, the, the, here's the thing, though. If you're in something, and now you're in it because you don't want to lose that. That's not the relationship anymore. So mm-hmm. it's like it, it it doesn't it doesn't make up for it doesn't justify you being unhappy. And it almost, it's just that you aren't leaving because you can't lose that. You'll be unhappier without that. But that has nothing to do with the actual and I, love. And I almost feel like it makes it more comfortable for Ken to do what he did because the fact that, well, this ain't this. really going to end. Yeah, you because ain't going nowhere. She's not, going, she's not going to lose that back. You know, and, 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 and not to say. Right, like well, that's what I said. Right. Yeah, I compared it to Chris Sales and Queen Naja right. because it was a very similar situation. And Queen Naja said right. she was almost afraid to leave him because she thought she would fail. But once she got that support, when and she couldn't take no more, she left, and it ended up working for her. But she was staying with him after being reasons. abused yeah. for the wrong reasons. But the main reason was for that income from yeah. that YouTube. But yeah. I feel like I feel like even let's go back. Right, a lot of our, our grandparents, great grandparents, they were married, and they they were married through a lot of bullshit. Yeah, yeah. Right? I feel like. You need some of that. You need some something more than just love. You need something more than just who you are. It's even, even, yeah. with, even I, I compare everything, but it's even with your goals, right? Sometimes, even me, I fall out of love with my goals. Sometimes I'm not happy where I'm at. Sometimes I want to quit, but it's something that drives yeah. me past that. So even in a relationship, right? It's not just about me and you. You got to find what drives you past that. It right. got to find what, what the reason for it, the but, mission. Right. You know what I'm saying? And I feel because like a lot even, of times, because it ain't what we think is love, yeah. it's not the, the real thing. But I feel like, nah, that's just cliche. We gotta... Because even when you think back to like Jada and Will, mm. like, you know what I'm saying? You look yeah. at situations like they, they've they tied but so I think much they're other... in the, they're, I think Jada and Will are like the the more 
a matured version, version of it. Of it. Yeah, they're like, staying exactly. together because, because of it's, it's, life, it's, it's more. It's more so. When they were younger, probably I'm sure. This, I'm sure it was terrible when they were younger. Matter of fact, I mean, you think know, about it now. I've heard he had no, but I'm saying one of them ain't in love no more. I can see. I don't think I just. I just think it adds to the story. I really think it's will. But but think about it. I think now Deirdre and Ken, it adds to that story when they older. Now they can say, you know, it was times where. I did this when I didn't mean it. Or besides when he made, when she did this and she didn't mean it, it just adds to the story. Right. So I'm not saying that, like, okay, obviously stuff like that happens. I'm just saying one perspective of what it could be. Mm. Now, it could just be the nigga had been with her for so long and he stepped out in this part of life and they're going to grow through this. But it also could be the other thing. We really don't yeah. know. Right. But we all yeah. can agree that had there not been that YouTube, that this probably will play out a lot differently. We can't agree to that because there's people that have regular relationships that go through the same shit. That's real. Yeah, and, 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 like but said, at a young age, a lot of them break up. But, but like I said, it's been, it's, 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 well, it's, it's been, a lot of girls who stay through infidelity. Right. I but mean, most, at Deer's no, age, I was most, through infidelity. Like, I did. But eventually you left. Oh, yeah. And this sure. isn't his first time. Mm -hmm. So that's why I'm saying. Yeah. You know, and especially think know. about it. Think about it. You got your, you got money. Mm -hmm. You feel me? You got a little name. Mm -hmm. I mean, you might be like, fuck you, nigga. But the problem is, you're attached to this goddamn yeah. name. Yeah. So now it's, mm -hmm, fuck yeah, you, Now nigga, you're more. Put the camera on it. Okay. Right, now right. you're more inclined to stay. We got to work. Let's yeah, we got work. shit to do. So it's yeah, not a know. relationship anymore. It's just business. But you know, so, Sade. Yeah. It's mostly business, but probably. now, Jay Hill. So have you ever, have we argued and you second guess breaking up with me because of the podcast? Yeah. Damn, that's yeah. crazy. Fuck this podcast. It's done. Yeah. We ended but up I told him that, like, because it's not even just a podcast. with I never thought about, I never not broke up with you because of the podcast. What? I never, nigga, I so never. You, so you're gonna sit here and lie and say I'll like, carry something else. You, we have argued and you be like, I mean, but we, you know, the podcast. You ain't, you it, never say, well, you want to say, we never always had that have conversation. To factor it in. You Listen always, to, that's what I'm saying. It's not that I was like, I can't do this because the podcast, but, but I, I factored you. it in. That's what I asked you. Okay, Mr. Literal. But I think that I'm saying I like think, factoring in. I think that yes, when, you really, I have. when you really don't but want I'm, something, you will leave. You don't give a fuck what it is. That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna fuck what it is. That's there we go. So like, if I really didn't want it, like that might have been an excuse. Like you know what I'm saying. Like, but even even in still. I factor in other things outside of the podcast, outside of our relationship. The place, relationship apartment? with Amaya, our that? apartment. Like, it's a lot of things. Wow. What? All I'm factoring in. You're a liar. Oh, look, he lying like I'm shit. Lying Go like ahead. Shit. He's a liar. But you know what? When shit. you become adults, that's what life is. Like, yeah. it's your partner. So, obviously, you know, you have assets joined or you have uh, it's an business joint. Yeah. It's, You've invested yourself. Right, right. So now I'm like, <laughs> I gotta go because I need to go find my nigga because now I get it. <laughs> Turn this off. <laughs> no, but like, <laughs> seriously. Tell the camera you're yeah. sorry. Tell I'm, the, the camera. <laughs> didn't understand it. Now I get it. Okay, <laughs> so yeah, that makes a lot more sense, Jay. Yeah. Thanks, cause you're if, welcome, sure yeah, you got you me, look bro. a lot better now too. Healing, you know what I'm saying? We, you look a lot better now. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, you look great. So that's very true. When you get older. There, uh, there are other factors that you're supposed to consider, yeah. and mm -hmm. it's business and other things like that. And you're not; it's not just supposed to be oh, love, love, love. It has to be like, Fuck what are we, Alex. what are, we, where are we getting with this? Where are we going with this? Like, how are we building? Yeah. in the midst of that. Yeah, but well. I still, I still say that when somebody's not happy with something, yeah. they will find their way out. I don't yeah. care how much money's on Bro, the table; none I, of that yeah, is worth your unhappiness. Right there is bullshit, though. Not saying what you're saying is bullshit, but the fact that we do that. That's you, well, yeah, that's again, you compromise like I, yourself. Like I said, not even compromise yourself is the fact that you don't. Because in my what career, mean, what? it's been mm. times where I wasn't happy and mm -hmm. I stuck through it. No, but I think she's you saying. You so why no, would I do that think, to somebody? Okay, because at a point, you still love it. See, there's a point where you just don't love it at all. Anymore. Or is it because you're yeah. say, so like, do you, you see the light at the end of the tunnel when you look, compromise it because you can still see the light? My, but if yeah. you don't see the light, but if you don't you still see the light, you move. Sometimes I don't see the light. That's why. I, that's mm -hmm. why I get weary of it well, because it's like, yo, I've been doing this for how many years? Where the fuck is the light? And, and it's kind of like it's kind of like you've seen the um. The, it's a meme, but it's a video where the guy is digging for the for the diamonds, right? He's he, right he, there. He gets, yeah. He's yeah, and then he quits. A thousand diamonds. The one dude gets the is one diamond. That's it. He, he goes to share it, right? And the other guy quits to go kill him to get his diamond, right? I say that like you don't know where it is, even though you don't see the light. We don't know where. And in, in, in so, a relationship, hold up, wait, wait, hold on, really quickly, because I like that analogy about the job and you don't quit. So, has has I guess the cheating? I'm trying to equate it here. Would it be like you hate your job and then it's like you call out sick even though you're not sick? Yeah, but is that even, the same thing I as the cheating? cheating like you right? step out for a second, cheating. but you, you didn't come to that final decision so yet. I'm, all right, I only can talk about marriage because I mean I haven't been married, but I'm thinking because in relationships, it ain't everybody's single. Yeah, you get know what I'm saying. In marriage though, right, it's a bigger goal. You made vows. What you mean you single? Yeah, yeah. And in, in, in a marriage, right, 
you have vows to this person. So you have a commitment to this person. In my, in my job, in well, my career, I have a commitment to my career. I, I made, I said I was going to pursue something. I'm going to get it. I'm going to do it until I get it. When you marry somebody, you eliminate you and you create us. So when it becomes to us, when somebody cheats, you got to get to the bottom of that. And that's why therapy is so important. Oh, yeah. So it's not about, it's not about, because hopefully. But what I, if the bottom of it is, I'm not happy with right. you. Right. No, no, and, and, that's what I, and that's where I was going to go. I feel like sometimes. Nothing like, you're going to do that's going to make me happy Even when we were again. talking about seeing the light at the terminal, I think like at some point you still think like your, your job is still worth it. Mm -hmm. It's still some progression. Like there is sometimes. Where it's just like, you know what? There is no more light. And I don't even want to see so it. No it cares. is. I don't care. I don't care. Nothing's worth no me staying yeah. through no this. I'm, I'm done. I'm calling right now. I swear mm -hmm. to God, right? That's one of the main reasons why I, like, when me and Shadi argue, that's why I wanted to stay with Shadi. Because I sold myself. Now, if I'm like, yo, I can't sit up here and lie and say I didn't see no progression. And because I seen progression, that's why a lot of things I've told her that I didn't want to tell her, I've told her because I, honestly, it's a part of me, just to be honest, a part of me want to work through that. A part of me honestly kind of want that. You get what I'm saying? A part of me want that story to be like, yeah, we had some we shit it and we, we got it through it, right? Mm -hmm. Like, so that's why a lot of times with things I don't want to tell her, I'll tell her because it's like, yo, I know this about to be some bullshit, but at the end, it's going to be worth it. You get what I'm yeah. saying? And even though I might, it might have been some bullshit, I ain't even smoke it. That's but, my yeah, point. But even, even though what I might have did presented with some bullshit or it might have been bad, it's like, yo, you know what? I'd rather take that L or take my accountability right here to get to the, to the end. Yeah. I say that to say, a lot of times when we were beefing, it was like, yo, you know what? I've seen the progression. And I think this is so much dope. You get what I'm saying? This is dope. And I feel like a lot of times we'd be ignorant to the progression. So even if somebody did cheat or like, I don't like, whatever, we got to understand that, yo, they are fighting, like I'm saying in marriage, when you marry somebody, when you decide to commit to somebody, you got to Well, they're engaged. Right. It's not even that. You got to understand that, yo, they, I'm, I'm marrying to you. The hardest part of our relationship is growing together because mm -hmm. God damn, yeah. it's hard to grow, to, yeah. grow individually. So when you're growing together, you have to understand that they ain't perfect. Just like I'm not perfect. And it's times where I don't even want to look at myself yeah. in the mirror. So if it's, if she fucks up or he fuck up. I got to be so willing to be like, yo, I'm going to fight through it with them, even though I don't want to. Because there's been times I had to fucking bite my tongue. There's been times where I had to kiss ass or whatever in my career when I didn't want to and I cried. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So if I can do yeah. that for my career for something that's, that can get stripped away from me, why not do that for somebody that I call family? Right. And so that know, kind of oh. goes back to the Nikki Giovanni thing, essentially, what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. Because it's like I'm doing it for these other, this other part of my life. But why can't yeah, I why apply can't you it to do this it? situation? Yeah, it's like, yo, like, and I also feel like even for like their situation, you know, I don't really know where they're at directly. But like, you know, I'm also open to the other side of the fact that like, I don't know if that is that. The, like, right. you know what I'm saying? Like, that's, cause that's like for dear, that might've been like, we did see the progression, but I no longer see it anymore because you keep re like, what is the word? Regret, you regress, regressing. regressing, right? You keep regressing and it's not progression anymore. So there are some points, you know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about for our relationship, but other, you know, speaking, it could be the fact that it's not progressing, you know what I'm saying? Especially because there is speculation Insanity. that this is not the first time. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I don't know 100%. I just know what gets said and what I've seen so far. It's, it's not his first time. And it could be yeah. potential regression. And it is sucks that they are in the public because they do have to deal with that in the public limelight. Um, and, you know, I feel like... There's got to be some truth to it, it because she didn't come out and say anything. She hasn't said anything. So and, you know, and, and that's where I was going to go next. It's just... How do you think he feels as the one? So, so say like it's it's on where Jazz saying like they might be done for real, and because the cameras are on, he was just really living, living his, his life. normal. Because right. one thing I seen in his apology, it was like, yeah, I did touch her butt, like you know what I'm saying inappropriately, but he acknowledged it so easy as if like that's He's something you're supposed to do. That. Like it's the norm. And I was going right? to say, it, how do we know? No, like how do you think he feels like being the one who got caught living his, his truth regular life. or his regular situation? And like say. They are just doing it for the cameras. the cameras and like they're not ready to let that side go. And now he's the one who gets caught because even the apology was so like vague. It like it's, so it's vague. almost like as if she knew and I'm sorry that this came out this way. Yeah. And now you're embarrassed because that ain't right because we know what it is yeah. between us. Yeah. Like, say, you know what I mean? All I'm going to say is this, yo. I'm not going to speak to the like the what if like if they wasn't. I'm just saying what if they are. Because on the way, another thing that I thought was odd was that he was out. And right. She was she out. wasn't even out. And, and it's like, girls. Yeah, and so I ain't seen no niggas. Me either. Where was so the it's like, where and where were you? Like, right. was, why were you so, just out here? What like, I'm, what I'm gonna say yeah. is, I'm gonna say to the point: if they are together, right? I feel like as a as a as a human race, right? And I'm gonna say for both sides, men 
we got to do better at seeking therapy because cheating mm -hmm. comes from something within. Just being honest, right? And I'm going to be totally transparent. You got to, we got to, we got to seek something that when something don't go our way to, to handle it another way than stepping out our relationship. Hold up. Women cheat too now. No, they sure I, I know, do. I know, but I, we sure talking do. about for the most part, we've seen all of our idols cheat on that woman. I, I seen a tweet Kanye that said that like, damn, Derek yeah. Ken, Jay Z, Cardi, so, Offset, like so, they literally named. So what I'm saying, well, no, 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 we just get caught. Nah, but I'm not, I'm not speaking on idiots. I'm not speaking on women. I mean, because, you cheat on Beyonce, you got wait, to be a fool. But wait, I'm not speaking. I'm only speaking <laughs> from a man perspective. If they cheat, then they can speak on that on their own. But this is something in my life. I'm gonna say like, as men, we got to do a better job at handling our emotions. And before that, we got to do a better job at seeking help because we don't know how to. Yeah. Or, even when nothing is going wrong. And woman, all I can ask, right? I'm pretty sure there's things that y'all can work on just like we can work on. What I will ask is continue to be patient with us because it's not personal. It's really personal with us. It ain't personal to you guys. It's really personal to us. So what I would say is woman, continue to be patient with the men, right? And Jay. not to the point where it's though is mm -hmm. hurting you. Jay, yeah, she's telling okay. like your mom. But I'm just Jay. No, I'm saying it like, I feel no like because I was going to say, you know, there's a difference between, and I think this is important for women to understand because this is how a lot of women end up in situations Real where shit. they're dead. Yeah. Um, they yeah. lose their children, something yeah. crazy because yeah. they kept saying, well, well I'm going to be patient. I'm going to be patient with him. Yeah. I'm going to be patient with him. Yeah, yeah, of course. And know when to walk away too yeah. as well. Learn you got to know when to walk yeah. away as well. That's, I'm, I'm just really, just, I'm, I'm trying to, I might not be saying it right, but I'm trying to give you guys props and like, you know, I said it before, it's, it, it hasn't been fair for women. You know what I'm no. saying? And again, right. there's been times, there's a lot of things I think women do to niggas that ain't fair too. But I this agree. Ain't, I agree. But yeah, this yeah, ain't, yeah, I'm yeah. not speaking yeah. on that. I can yeah. speak yeah. on that when the time is allowed. You know what I'm saying? For right now, we're talking about Ken cheating on Yeah. Pierre. So in this moment, I'm only acknowledging the men that cheat. You know what I'm saying? So what I'm saying is, shout out to the women that are patient, right? Of course, you got to know when to walk away. Mm -hmm. Of course, you got to know when it's time to go. Mm -hmm. I can say that about men and women in situations. Mm -hmm. But again, all I'm saying is, continue to understand that in every situation, is not always the same. Yeah, it's and, not. And, and I think you have to learn. And shout out to my woman. Let me say, shout out to the woman because y'all don't get it fair. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie, like niggas, every nigga got. Is, yeah. is and, like I, and I think it's just important for women to learn. <laughs> so shout how out to, to the woman. Shout out to them. Thank you, babe. Oh my shout god, was that rare? Yeah. Wow. See, we can't even just like, clapping. So what I will say is too, like you know, just in terms of what Jazz said, because I think that's a huge point as well, and I understand what Jay's saying. But I also think that like women just have to do a better job picking guys that are even worth fighting for, because mm. I think a lot of time women pick men and think they're giving them the same discernment as the man who is worthy of having that Dang. discernment. Mm -hmm. And sometimes that's not just I'm true. I'm going to go with you, babe. Yeah. Like, I'm going to go with you with this one. Yeah. I don't think they got to do it. And, and Alex, too. I'm a, I don't think they got to do a better job at picking the men. Right. You got to do a better job at picking yourself and God. Mm, picking God and yourself, because yeah. a lot of times yeah. we're not praying in these situations. Yeah. Things happen yeah. and we're not praying. You know what I'm saying? You yeah. gotta, you gotta do a job. I mean, yeah. I don't know what y'all. Or be just intentional I mean, on what you want. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. being intentional on what you want. Because like you, you mentioned Cardi yeah. B and Offset, and it's like, but he's still cheating on her to yeah. this day. Like, we don't just, know that. Uh, it yes. just happened. Yeah. Remember, and she filed for divorce, and then she and went she right back. It. She said it. Like she said it out her own I mouth. So it. I think it's one of those things where you know, you you have to decide when you are not loving yourself to love somebody else. Exactly. That's when you got to yep. walk both away. Both sides. Yep, both sides. Yeah. Yep. Once you stop loving yourself to love somebody, yeah. then it's time for you to go. All righty, man. That was a great conversation. Gemini Scorpio Podcast, episode yeah, 46. Team. Hey, love the conversation. Let's not continue to grow. Let's continue to progress. Uh, let's work on this live podcast. However, if we can, because they about to shut it down again. Uh, fuck um, I know. Again. Yo, oh, my God. Peace. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, Gucci shit. Gucci. So... Woo. Now Gucci, Gucci in real life. I like right. Gucci. Thank you. Yo, we but really Jeezy, on the same. but Jeezy's music. Wow, that's woo. crazy. I was listening that's to Jeezy really on my way on over this. On bitch. So okay, Gucci like or Jeezy? <laughs> So I said, what? Scorpio Pop? No, no, we, 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 we agree on that. I, 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 I wanted, I wanted to tweet that how Jeezy. much I love Jay, but I don't think I like Gemini. I don't think it. You like Janaya? Janaya's a Gemini. Oh my God, she is. <laughs> she is. A but she's the last day. She's on the cusp of a cancer. That's why. That's I why. like cancers. But why do you like Gemini's? Y'all are a lot. Nigga, like, you don't think y'all are a lot? That's fine. That's a Scorpio. I'm, that's I'm a giving, Scorpio thing. I'm just giving you what you're. If you think we're a lot, that's fine. <laughs> don't shoot. I just think <laughs> you know Gemini's are a lot. Like, and they we make you. Push, we push. No, whoa! Don't get carried away. This. Everybody told me this. I don't Gemini's, care. What. 
push you to be who's the, everybody? Better, who's a lot of people, people said this. Gemini's teach you patience. Okay, because I got a Gemini daughter. Exactly, they, they teach do, you patience and they do, because they're so fucking wishy-washy. They're moody as hell. They and they have you. the power to be in one room and it could be as happy as they want it. Or they'll yep. drag yep. that motherfucker down. And you know what it down. teaches you to do? It and teaches you not to react it, so quickly. Exactly. Because you have to have yeah, patience. Because you're like, all right, I know, you know this, what? I've seen this move before. Seen. Yeah. Right. So yep. what does Scorpio teach you? Please let me know. Scorpio teaches you loyalty. They Six. teach you toughness. They yeah. teach you wow. how to That's win. Thing. They like, teach they you grace. Cannot, yeah. They, they teach, teach you confidence. In the mirror. They yeah. teach you shit. I don't think a mirror exists with a face. They teach you reality. They fucking teach you drip. They teach you. Come on, knowledge. Come on, Wisdom. what's up? What's so up? We bring so what, what, everything. A bad thing, right? No. no. Anyway, be lying. Um, right? Like that's what, it, right there. I, I, I thought a cancer said something. What a cancer say? I thought a cancer. Too, cancer. But it is, it is. I thought a cancer said something. Not, not, not the passive aggressive sign. Look, not the passive aggressive sign. You seen? You seen? You seen how we self reflect? Yeah, we be lying to you. I'm saying they can never, but we don't ever do anything. But anyway, we don't. Right. No, I will admit the only thing about a Scorpio is that y'all sneaky. Oh what? no, 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 no. no. To walk up I was gonna say we're yeah. real <laughs> to a fault. We're real to a fault. Because sometimes we don't know how to not say what's going on. No, we always gotta say it. And we say it sometimes a little say too it. quickly. And then it's harsh. And then it's harsh. It's harsh. And then it's no coming back from you, it. Didn't you just stop, talk to me about that? Come on. Yeah. Thanks. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll yeah, go with that. I can't, I can't, I can't don't We shoot first, don't, ask questions yeah, later. Yeah, we shoot first but and honestly, ask honestly, questions honestly, later. Honestly, yeah. Because Gemini's I'd rather like, fucking kill a nigga before they kill me and even take the and, chance. Yeah, and, and honestly, if, if I'm wrong, then so I gotta live with that. And I'm wrong. I gotta live with that. But I'm alive. I'm alive, though. And I'm alive. I didn't feel me. When it comes to female Scorpios, I think they have a hard time of looking at self in the mirror and self reflecting. I reflect every day. I reflect every like they day. Cannot... I think Gemini's have a problem that I don't reflect how they want me to reflect. <laughs> and that's yes, the problem. That's and it. I don't have to that's do it, it your way. That's I can reflect it. my way that's and it. not be your way. That's and you need it. to be okay with that. But yeah. see, they're not okay with that because Gemini's want you to do it their way. Or they're not. This is a Gemini. Shit. If they don't see you reflect, then it didn't then happen. It didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Come if, on. If you didn't, if he didn't feel like I did it, it yeah, I never then did it didn't it. happen. Even if I did it in a room, even if I cried in the bathroom, even if I did it in my head, yep. yeah, I, you didn't tell me you did it right away, yep. so because, you didn't no, do it. I, I say that because you know what? You like, didn't do it long I, as enough. Gemini's, right? And I think it might just be a man and woman thing because I honestly feel like if I'm wrong, I'm gonna tell you know what? Yeah, you're right. I don't agree with that all the time. I can't say I all Gemini's. I'm going to disagree they, with they, you. They, they, Let me tell you why. Too, Let me tell you why. You said it, no, no, wait, wait, wait. Let me tell you the greatest extreme. I'm going to go to extremes. Right, hey, I'm going to go to an extreme. Even in this moment, look. Even in this moment, I'm like, you know what? The Ooh. president of the United States. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> It's a exactly. fucking Gemini. Exactly. There it is. And there it is. is. Like, I can I just mention? Crazy. I can I mention that. one thing? And before we end this Kanye podcast, was a Gemini too. Like, and before we end this podcast, this we was in Tulum. There was another birthday girl. She's a Scorpio. I watched her and Jay argue for two hours, <laughs> and she said half the things I said to Jay. And bitch, I was sitting back like, and I thought wow. she was fucking stupid. <laughs> The you fuck! See? I looked at her you like see? you're dumb. You see? She, uh, she ain't make no was, sense. Shout out she to Sata. Shout out to Sata. Her birthday was November third. Or she didn't second. make no sense. So no, Shada even, no, Shada even was like, "No, nah, I, I get it. I get no, what no, but she I got what shit. she was trying to say, and she said the same things about Jay that I said in meeting him one day. In seeing one day, so it, so in one be fucking true. day, I was like, see, look at this nigga. She Yo, I will call us out to right now. She played. You know, she told Jay off the first day meet her. You got patriarchy thinking. And what I say? What I say? He what thought, I, you know what Jay I said? What, what I, I do. Right, but that's the difference. Is that that's wrong? Really, no, <laughs> that's difference because you admit to I'm it. Like, no, Man, that's yes, why I told him, I said, just yes, because I had to break down submissive point, and patriarchy to Jay because I had to tell him just because you admit to it does not mean these things are but right. No, that's no, I never said no, but at least at the man, least, let the Gem, let the Gemini at, at, man do listen, the Gemini at thing, least, man. at least I'm gonna live. acknowledge like, it. I saw, I saw I'm, I'm a Scorpio, I'm a Scorpio till the day I die. At bare you can minimum, acknowledge I can it, right? Acknowledge but I told him, no, no, you don't tell him, no, 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 because let me tell you what it is. Y'all do it, let me tell you what it is. No, no, listen, this is what it is. Anything I said, fuck that. No, they could have said it. Anything I said, I stand on that motherfucker. Right, I, I, my point. Go here again. Hey, go, go, go here again. My point. Yeah, listen, my go point. Here again, Everything y'all said, said about it. me. What I say? Fair. You know what? I can see that. Everything I said about them. No, no, no. Gemini Scorpio podcast episode forty six is a fucking dub. <laughs> see y'all later. It's a wrap. <laughs>